<laughs> Thank you. Oof. Hey, um, how's everybody doing? Does anyone know mm, who beat Arslan in this? <laughs> Thank you. You know, mm, he's like the only guy that can beat me. <laughs> Thank and you. someone beat him. Who beat him? Anakin 2 Odin? <laughs> that is sick. Are you sure? Anakin 2 Odin? <laughs> that is super tight. I gotta turn on my Warnado, dude. Heard you're pretty good. ATL ho. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, EX Double and Nomad, thanks. Spooky Fist Pump, Bean Burrito. Are they talking yet? <laughs> Thank you. Oh shit. Tell me what to buy. Uh, double shave club? Tell me, let me get one of those. Man, this has been a wild one so far. Have you guys been watching? Tekken players in the world have arrived in the Las Vegas desert and they are getting prepared for WSOE7. The Damn. Tekken and slow motion Soul makes everyone showdown. look tough. Great action coming up here. Except Jimmy. <laughs> Man, he used to look so tough when he had that crazy hair and beard. In time, only a desert will tell. Where hidden secrets. Anyway, thanks, um, Yerkes and DZV. Thanks, Prism and Doc Momo. Saint Puns, Meat Tape, Flan Mingo. This is all over the place. This is all over the place. Uh, I'm gonna have a lot of stuff to talk shit about, I think. Let me just focus. Northbound and Soul Splicer. Uh, let's see here. Uh, Timber. Mm, a dude plays game. Silza. Thanks for all the subs, everybody. And Quantum OP. And also Hackball and Black Dude. Thanks, Black Dude. And Exodial Lover. And Set Up to Fail and Baseball. Thanks, everybody. Uh, what happened? Arslan got DQ'd? Are you guys making that up? Arslan got DQ'd, so all that one in a million talk was made up? I don't know what to believe now. I know he's in Losers. I know he's in losers, but I don't know how he got there. Ladies and gentlemen, we are back with WSOE 7, the Tekken and Soul Caliber Showdown. Second half coming up next. Doesn't it feel like they have such a really nice studio, you know? But everyone's behaving like such a like a little kid, you know? It's like uh, the people who really work in this studio are letting their kids have some fun. I can't wait to see this. You know what this I mean? Be the big one. This is the one that Everyone's wearing their dad's hexing pants. Hexing Thank you. What are you doing why? wearing your dad's hexing see. pants? They're it's too big. People in the air and juggling them. That, that's what it looks like <laughs> on the surface, but you're going to come to find why everyone loves this game. And here's the All thing. Right. Quick update for you guys at home. Sure. We just got word that every single match will be on the main stage. So we were going to show you guys the entire action. Nice. That's All cool. Right. Of course, the format for today, it is going to be an eight-player hey, tournament. Double elimination. Some of the players already in the bottom half of the bracket. In the loser side, you guys can see every there that's gonna be whoa here today some of the best players from <laughs> that's Anakin <laughs> they're playing for fifteen thousand that's pretty good that's pretty good I like that they made cartoon characters out of all of them you guys see this this is gonna be an amazing battle we're gonna find out who will be the WS damn that's hilarious oh shit damn anonymous dropping the big hondo throwing off my twitch acting we're showing love both communities thanks, man. Grow, the Bandai Namco fighting game community. Thanks, That's Anonymous, sure. and thanks, Juan, for the other big hondo. Oh, yeah. Damn. Do we have those bounties thanks, up? man. I'm trying to concentrate the here. We'll Mid performance. We're gonna tease that. Thanks, okay, man. Okay. Here, here. All the, all the, you know, ah, seat moisteners that you gifted, <laughs> they <laughs> definitely <laughs> appreciate it, too. Say thanks. I guess some, you don't uh, have to say thanks. Bruce I'll say Butler thanks action. for them. Oh. The man himself, hey, thanks. To to count us down and to ring in Tekken 7, Bruce Buffer, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Bruce Buffer? <laughs> Thank you. Shh. Too 
close. Hey, thanks again, Anonymous. And Kaden Souls. Welcome to the esports capital of the world, Las Vegas, Nevada. As this is the moment. <laughs> Dude, I gotta get this guy to. I gotta hire this guy too. How much does this cost? <laughs> I gotta, I gotta hire this guy. I'm gonna hire this guy to talk to me for a while. If you could hire him for this, woo! Damn! <laughs> that was so sick. I gotta get that guy for my birthday. I gotta get that guy for my birthday. That was oh, yeah. super Did you see that? This His mouth was wide open. The winner's side, we have Nia, who many Holy the shit. World. Going against Jun Ding, a very, very strong player who has made his mark in the second Hey, world so world. All, yeah, all, all, damn, cargo all pants? Me, all cargo pants contender. aside. Damn, uh, <laughs> the double ear. <laughs> This is already so good, dude. This is already so good. It's like a GTA 5 casino. The gestures, dude. He just hit the gesture the moment he came on stage. What up? Nice. Man, Anakin. Looks tough. Damn, the scheming. This shit's gonna be sick, dude. These players are really good. You know, that's what makes it sick. The players are really good. The level of the matches is going to overshadow all the weird, uncomfortable dialogue between everybody. Have you guys been watching, dude? This is what I'm so excited for. You got Jimmy J. Tran. Do you guys remember that event? I think it was a Capcom Cup where one of the players, they had like... <laughs> They had doors that would go up and down, and one of the players came out, and the door fell on top of his head. Do you remember that? He's going up against Jimmy J. Tran. This is I don't remember what was that. Kazunoko. Man, leave it to Capcom. Was that Capcom Cup? That was the funniest shit, dude. That shit hit him in the head. Oh man. You can't you can't script that stuff or else I would. I would. But you can't. Thank you. This is gonna be good. Damn, why is Lohai giving the sassy eyes? It looks, everyone kind of looks sassy. Hold on, hold on. There are so many good mm, players Thanks, Dermot like and Killa Bubba Dog. Big thanks again, Anonymous. That's Game super nice of you, man. I'm glad you really I'm like my stream. I'm going to turn this down. Chicago, my wow. Tell me how the amazing. volumes you are. Uh, thanks, High Chair and Dermot, Chest Rockwell, Frankie Beans, Gwerk, Bamboo, King Cobra Kai, Zero Kyo. Thanks very much. Jerry and Naju. At the matchup. So Hola. You can see, you Thanks. Can see in the winners round one, that's all the stuff that happened on day zero. But going into the winner semis, which Markman, I think Markman so used to always wear a suit when he commentated. Not a suit suit. He would wear. Originally, he would wear a Mad Cat shirt with a blazer on top. So that's like old news. But you know, like I said, this type of a presentation, it's like they're. I don't know, man. I, I was told that I'm. Uh, they're looking for constructive criticism too. So if I want to like give them pointers on what I think would suck a little less next time no, you know they're listening and stuff. The match to watch from these first round you know what I mean boy, and boy let me tell you I hope they got some time on their hands I'll tell you so far from what I'm watching a uh, problem is that you have a lot of people that have to say a lot of words to cover a lot of time but the things that they're saying mm, have no substance so Either you could change the people, so like for example, the, everyone involved who's making small talk with each other, they all have to know a lot about Tekken, and they have to have a good rapport. So you need to hire a team of people that work together and all know each other well and know Tekken to lose uh, the awkwardness of having some random Dota player uh, trying to sound cool and some other dude shaving his beard in the bathtub and then having some poor girl dress up like nina and be interviewed about tekken 
first time. I mean, that I just, jealous. even if okay. she isn't like, being forced to do that, to me, oh, it looked oh, like she was being forced. Dress up like Nina and sit there and pretend to talk about Tekken. Now, if that's not the case, that's irrelevant. That's how it felt. And you don't want it to feel that way. I mean, at the very least, put her in some regular clothes and, you know, it just would be better, more appropriate. She looked great, awesome cosplay, but it felt weird to me. Put the Nina cosplay there too, but don't have her be the one that has to be like, so tell me more about this matchup, Rip, while she's dressed like a fucking character, you know? It doesn't feel right to me. That's my one, one uh, criticism I have. I feel like this tournament is impossible to predict. It's yeah. so wild. The results are just going to be incredible. <laughs> yeah. so I'm just Man. Go to uh, I'm gonna go you know, to whatever. Uh, Thank you. To take on Arsenal Nash first round and make it all the way to the tournament. So, okay. No drones. Yeah, that's a good point. Uh, hey, thanks. Nasa Al Salam and Chinese name and Raynero. Slightly Incredible Hulk, Unholy Lotion, Stand Stab, and Unlucky Kose, Jux, and The Reaper. Also, this has happened many times. This is a fucking train wreck right here. Having two people from two different... Four people are yelling at each other. Nobody knows what they're talking about. Everyone's full of shit right now. No, they're killing time. This is a disaster. This is a disaster. All they're doing is talking over each other. Nobody knows what they're talking about. They're all talking shit and wasting time. This is not what you want. What you want is purpose. Oh, man. Hey, maybe I shouldn't say anything at all. I'm getting the feeling that maybe I shouldn't say anything at all. You know? Because... <laughs> you still paying for that. Uh, uh, well, that's going to be a very interesting first round losers match then, I guess. Yeah, Bummer. Line, right? <laughs> well, I mean, you know, that's cool. <laughs> the bathwater joke is cool, but earlier they had this guy on the right get in there. As part of the halftime show. I mean, they could have talked about Soul Calibur during that whole time. They could have... Or Tekken. I mean, they could have given the viewer... Like, uh, when I heard WSOE, I thought WSOP, World Series of Poker. And during the halftime of a WSOP, you can expect those two old dudes being like, well... This is the river card, and this, you know, you gotta, you, it, they're explaining the game, and they're kind of giving you, like, mm, eye junk food by showing you interesting things, hands, and card dealers dealing shit, right? Aces, and they're giving you rules. They're also including the sponsors in there. You know, this, this, uh, hey, keep it down. Uh, this, you know, recap, fight recap is brought to you by whatever, Dollar Club or whatever it's called, right? So they're doing that, but at the same time, it's not like totally abrasive. You know, if you're going to have someone get in a shower, right? Your primary audience is going to be Soul Calibur and Tekken players. I mean, if you're going to have someone get in a shower... At least make it someone that the viewing audience gives a fuck about. I'm not sure I know who the guy on the right is. Does anyone know who that is? So, it, whoever he is, he's probably a really famous dude that does this all the time, right? So, it makes me think like, okay, but it would have been probably better if you got someone else to do it. Ideally, you know, the Nina cosplayer would be the best. But, you know, someone who's a Tekken... Uh, you know, something like that. Thank you. Uh, if you're gonna do something so asinine, you know, I I would get that whole thing out of there, personally. Thank you. And Tekken showing up. WSOE supporting both. By the way, how about the fact that it's the week before Evo? These guys have a chance to practice on land in a big tournament with a lot at stake. That's why it's so crazy. All my criticisms though have been up to this point. Just uh, like because I watched the Soul Caliber part. Hey, did you guys ever get to the bottom of uh? You know, mm, 
gets to represent Team USA. Who beat Arslan? Why is he in losers? Some people said he missed it. That doesn't sound possible. How could he have missed it? Is gonna suit and to call the action of that gameplay. We got Tasty Steve. He wasn't there yet. for the first time. Looks like see you Spitfire, bro. That sponsor is offensive to me. Hey, thanks, Smash player. Why? Uh, I don't think you're gonna be shaving. I mean, for a few off, years at least. This is not the first time that these guys have played, so they are familiar with each other. <laughs> yeah, that means thank it's you. Be right. this I'm is, examining this is, uh, the the, the whole the operation. I love how there are checks in the background for fifty thousand dollars, but the winner gets seven thousand five hundred. Did you notice that? That whole fucking background was checks with fifty thousand dollars on it. Hey, uh, a sorry and Smash player, Splody, Crim, Zero Nos, Mexican Buddha. Killer Raptor, Alien Action, uh, Mega Wants. I'm trying to concentrate here. You know these guys are homies. That's cool. Damn. This is sick. These players are really good. All of them. Excuse me. Why did you whine about phone, secret Discord coaching? Do you mean why did Nee whine? Nee was the one that tweeted about that. But maybe you're ill informed. I only repeated what Nee uh, complained about. I couldn't care less. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. Anyway, hope you're doing well. Uh, you know Ni, nee, right? He's the Korean Tekken player. He was the one that complained about that on Twitter. I don't give a fuck what they do. All I care about is making sure that the viewing experience is as good as possible. That's my primary, you know, I, that's what I care the most about. And last season, when they had that shitty fucking rule where if you rematch... They have to like, stage like select again. That was interrupting my viewing experience. So I had to put my foot down. You know? Volume. It seems low. No, that's too loud. I don't want to hear that. Thank you. Oh, the wave went to the hop kick. JDCR. Uh huh. It's still too loud. Get out of here! Nah. He needs a saint level miracle comeback. Does he have it in him? Checking him on the legs. Oh! No! Oh! Thanks, Kyle. Police is my mom and Master J Man. Uh, thanks, Smash Players, Floaty, and Asari. Happy Big Saturday, everybody. What did you guys have for lunch? I had pizza. That's right. So good. Winner semis of this top eight. This is a, that's a very dangerous game to play. A lot of people know you get time in Tekken, but you know, you do get those three rounds. You do get 60 <laughs> yeah, seconds. Thank it's you. It's still really hard to close out. If you got two great players, you're looking at defense really good. Chorizo? Really, good, really <laughs> thank solid, you. good ass Tekken, man. Mm -hmm. You had yeah, little yeah, seizures yeah, yeah, pizza? Yeah, Fat bong ribs, huh? Quite some time. Uh, thanks, you know, Knuckles and Thingles. Some RW and Luster Soldier. Of course, Thanks, guys. I think every jams. one of the stages is one of your jams. No, no, but that's... Is there know, one that's, that's not your jam? There's levels, Seth. There's, there's <laughs> levels to the jam. You didn't know? That's the say jam. Oh, that, gosh. Oh, nice break right there. Is that the lowest level? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> well, I said before. Shout out to my little <laughs> yeah, Thank you. Hey, yeah, I love Kappa. pizza. Oh, back oh. one. Wow, that's a king combo. Damn, are you serious? Oh, that's good. God. That's a, I mean, not king, that's a jack combo, jack only. Did you see that? Two things in that combo were jack only. The starter and the wall part. That was sick. You know, this armor king pick has been kind of, I felt, holding him back. This is the kind of stuff that, like, the little edge that you get in a matchup. Like this. That kind of thing is nice. Being able to do a full combo like that off of counter hit back one, he's going to be using that move a lot more because of the raised value in this matchup. Nice attempt at a whip punish right there. Gets a little damage. 
Yeah, no counter hits though, right? He's, he's going for these forward twos. He's getting some nice whip punch with them, but are never hitting anybody, so he's never getting a counter hit. I wonder if this is a hard fight for Jack. Well. I could see no, it. Now he's going for a forward two of his own, actually. That's how I got that offense back. Double oh, rage. Oh, no. That's unbreakable. He's so far away. I've never seen yeah. him from there. Yeah, that was really that was far. Excuse far. me. I, I think it's because of Jack's big body, but here we go. It's going to be set. I was thinking that same thing, already. really far away. Dominant so far here. Attic has got to turn things around big time. And that offense is starting to mount for him with JDCR every time with a stop. Oh, no break on the multi. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Okay, there we this go. This is two out of three, I think. Wow, he went for the hop kick on the tech, too. That was nice. Yeah, there was no whip punish once again Yikes. by Anakin. There's Delayed. a low parry. Yeah, he stayed in that low parry stage. You can see him crouching, uh, waiting uh. for that low parry. That was well done by JD that time. Looking to close it out here. Anakin, way behind the big wow. down forward two. Ooh, opportunity. Whip. Okay, gets the tailspin, too. That shit is still <laughs> funny, dude. About 15 seconds mm -hmm. Fucking oh no. <laughs> that shit still yeah, cracks me up. Look out. I think the part that still like God, remains oh, funny ready. after all this time is his confidence. That's what I love about it. His confidence level. I don't need a translator. Hell no. Why would I need a translator? Uh, Curzon, thanks. Uh, Leandroid, yeah. Corn Nuts, thanks, uh, Deviants and Mellow Melon, Knuckles, Thingles, thanks everybody. Happy big, uh, whatever day it is. There it is on your screens, six rounds straight. And again, looking a little but hurt. Was that losers or winners? Hey, so what's up with the bracket? Could you guys give me a link? Is there a link? That's actually crazy. Now that I think about it, you know, Anakin's that was weird. At this point was against Arson Ash, except Arson wasn't here. So Anakin I don't want the link to have dicks. Default, right? That's true. So pretty ridiculous. Pretty crazy. Singular or uh, modular. Hey, I can't oh, click man, that. I can't that. Anakin, out all Hell no. Hey, you guys better not be fucking around right now. Tell me that it was not nail biting Fallout. Tell me. Unbelievable, man. Listen, bring the bring the Tekken Panda back out with that broom because we got a 3030 sweep. Clean sweep on this main stage here. Unbelievable start. And Steve, I'm just saying, this brother, guy, dude. The, <laughs> the guy on the left. So, you know, not over yet. <laughs> that guy's you too good. What's that guy's name? That oh, we got a real Reason one. Hold on. Well, we'll see Better not be dicks. You're finna get shot. Oh, nice. Yeah. Shoot that guy. Uh, anyway, okay, so brackets. Uh, Nee versus John Ding. Now he's in the winner's final, guaranteeing himself a top three finish. I mean, off stream. Okay, here we go. Off stream, they did Cuddlecore versus me. Me won. They did Low High versus Jong Ding. Jong Ding won. They did Arslan versus Anakin. Anakin moved on, but it apparently was because uh, Arslan didn't make it on time. He got DQ, which still counts as a win for Anakin. Nice win. Uh, I heard he was good. I guess not. <laughs> anyway, uh, JDCR fought against Jimmy J. Tran, and he JDCR won. So that's how they created this today's bracket. Is representing, of course, not only female players, not only African Americans, but a lot more than that. One of the players we'll definitely be keeping a close eye on today is exactly her. She's been on the rise this past year in Tekken 7. There's much more to her than gaming. Let's learn more about the Chicago native. Oh, damn, there's a... <laughs> I shouldn't have even looked at the chat. As soon as that guy said African American, I should have closed the chat for 10 minutes. I knew you guys would have a field day with that shit. <laughs> Where do you guys pick this shit up? At school? Museum of African American History. It's very important to me because it displays different types of black artists and one of the founders of this museum man uh, you guys behave could you please well. behave you and know there could be people that are new here you're giving a bad first impression included injustices when it came to our mm. people you can tell like, she had a lot of passion and fire for every single thing Thank she you. made and it, you, sh you could tell what she stood up for and it inspires me because I want to do the same thing with my art <laughs> thank you wow I didn't know that. I didn't know she was an artist. Art has allowed me
me to express myself when I don't have Hey, words. now that's some information oh, I'm into. That's and dope. I, was able to tell I have a lot of respect for, people. you know, artists. Being able to have a discussion. There are like, some yes. really yes. talented air subs with who are artists. Is really talented. So much I mean, like... I can't believe they're heiress subs. Growing what the fuck happened? A community that uh, wasn't really developed at the time. I was usually one of the only black you know? people in my classes. And sometimes that did make me feel a little odd. Like, relatability was really hard. Some of the prejudice I did experience was actually sometimes oh, man. from This is hardcore. Uh, because I didn't sound a certain way, they, they would say that I sounded more white. It, it made it harder for me. This is really putting me in a situation here. <laughs> because you guys are funny, but you're also so inappropriate. You know? So you're really putting me in... <laughs> you guys are... Hey! <laughs> What's going on here? They'll talk about how I inspire them to go out there and compete, even with their fears of maybe being judged. That's definitely true, you know? That is super true. Like She's like succeeding. really she good. She kicks the shit out of hella good players. I'm sure not not just chicks. Dudes are inspired by her too. Everyone. You know, I'm inspired. I don't think I'm a chick I it's a as far as I know. And I'm pretty sure I'm not black. black so I don't think that this necessarily has to do with being people. black or being a girl. Use but it also a does. A creative mark, a stamp that just makes whatever that thing that we touch, it just blossoms. Do you think those drum guys were actors? I didn't know that my color... Or were those, like, in, real... And how I this is pretty high budget. They could color. easily get actors. And I, and I'm glad to those were paid actors? Not feel oh, so shit. To, to, to those be were who they paid are, actors. To be the best they can be, because, you know, if I can do it, they can definitely do it, too. Nice. <laughs> Thank you. I feel like I made it through that relatively unscathed. Nice. <laughs> Just a couple of dings on the hull of the ship, but we made it out of that. Uh, not too much damage sustained. Uh, thanks very much, Chinese name and Mighty Burrito. Uh, Meow Mon and Addy Sin. Thanks for the tier two. SAS Sauce and PSG One. Uh, Phil Cabinet. Salvador STMZ. Dr. Gormfish, really Big Wig, Dannings, uh, Curzon, Leandroid, and Cornnut. Thanks. One of the best female players in North America. What but ship? Hasn't even been brought up as part of the conversation, <laughs> which is really amazing to see. You know, a spaceship. Like the uh, and Enterprise. Really yeah. Stage. Well, guess what? She's on your screen right now. She's what ship did you think? You know, I'm telling you, man, you guys who do that shit, all you're doing is self-snitching. You know? All you're doing is self-snitching that you're a little bitch. <laughs> not that you're a bigot, not that you're a racist, that you're a little bitch. Simple as that. And I'm talking to the mods, too. All of you. I bet you there are some respectable people in this chat room who are probably doing this dumb fucking shit. I bet you there are. In real life, I bet you there are. You're just like, eh, everyone else is doing it. Thanks, uh, Dang Lin Wang. <laughs> I'm 34 years old, you know. But you know, his whip punishment game is fantastic. His poke game up front, up close, very good as well. And Coco brings his round back now. Spends the rage drive. Oh, God. Oh, God! The full round comeback from Coco Core. Hey, thanks. Thanks, Dang. I was just talking about how good low high is. Oh, no, again, though, no throw check. Gotta watch out. Hey, you know, so far this stream has been pretty funny, at least. I gotta give it to WSOE. If they were gonna name it that, they should have just followed the formula of the World Series of Poker as well, as far as presentation, too. Smile, smile. Smile, smile. Oh, hey, thanks, Valdezzi. Hope you're doing great, muchacha. 
Yeah, didn't expect Appreciate that it. one and all the hits of it as well. Double smile. Oh my goodness. Wow. Show the chat. So ready while standing two gets the launcher. It's such a big risk there from Cuddle too. And it just seems like she's having a hard time opening them up right thanks, now. Thanks, Spice Master. <laughs> and thanks, <laughs> man, <laughs> in the planet. And thanks again, Hey, what are you looking at? Secret Discord tech for godlike food at Evo. I mean, it's pretty hard to go wrong in Vegas. Usually, the hotel itself, though, doesn't have good options. Like, I think they have a subway. They don't have good options. You don't have good options. But if you're willing to go, like if you have a rental car or something, or if you drove, uh, you can't go wrong in Vegas. I mean, there are really good burger places, Gordon Ramsay restaurant. It's a little pricey, but really good. Uh, what's that Japanese burger fusion place? That place is pretty good. Uh, they got Shake Shack right on the strip. There are lots and lots of good, good places to eat. You know, I mean, Cuddlecore was able to bring back the first round. But For sure. They have good everything. <laughs> Doesn't matter what it is. throw that is a launcher and can get you to wall where he's very strong and has very strong wall bubble. No, that's a that's 100% true. But I wonder what she's going to do now. Because it just seems like... It's still early. She's harnessing. Damn. She's harnessing hard. To get that offense. Chewing on those strats. That's how he got his whole offense started with that throw. Excuse me. So you know breaking is integral at this point. Look at fresh. Nice sidewalk there. Do you guys think that Arslan Ash does that late flight shit on purpose so that he can get documentaries written about him and shit? How the hell did that happen again? He was late? Dude, if he wins this tournament, they're going to do a documentary. They're going to be like, you know, he had all this trouble and, you know, adversity. And despite missing his first match and getting disqualified, he persevered, etc. and so on. I can already see it in my YouTube feed. Nice strat. He's twitch acting. Man. I think, chat room, both you and I, we have a little too much fun talking shit. I think that, that is for sure. But it's not our fault that they make this shit, you know, like, you gotta, you gotta have your own fun. What do you want me to do, listen to Rip? Oh, you. <laughs> Beautiful Your laugh is contagious. And he hasn't Stay even used cool. the set. Hey, all right, man. There Thanks, go, Hyper Optics and Samad. Thanks, Addy Sin. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Main the planet, man in the planet, man in the planet, and unsung hero. And just like that, Loi about to close it out now. Last chance, a down back. Get a close it out. Thank Loi, you. Two to zero. Jeez. That was rough. That Damn, this has been fast so far. That was 2020. So far, Korea versus the U.S. has been a big blowout. Thank you. Take that into account in this matchup, but still, gotta be a hard feeling, especially for Kota Kaur only getting that one round in that first game. I mean, this is the story so far, man. The Korean players are dominating, you know, as kind of expected. But right now, they're sending on back the desperate fallout and get some insight from our analyst. That's so, thanks so much, guys. And yeah, tough draw indeed. Of course, Lohai, the reigning Evo <laughs> champion. Stop looking at us. <laughs> where does that? He's looking to win this one. Big losers bracket round one win for him. He's gonna advance. Oh yeah, and, you know, obviously he was looking. Man, for that that, that interview long, where it they, was I mean, Markman and Rip, 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 and they were being interviewed by Nina Williams. That shit was brutal, dude. What makes Law so good? And they were also yeah, commentating yeah, through that that bathtub thing. They should have had Markman dress up as Sub Zero or something, and this guy could be Kermit the Frog or. Some other uh, Hanson. Walls are so important in Tekken. Oh, yeah. uh, we just came from Soul Calibur, where of course they have the ring out system, so walls are, you know, there's something, but yeah. getting that ring out is more important. But in Tekken, getting somebody up against the wall is just death. Yeah, right? I mean, one of the most important things about Tekken is moving around. When you're stuck at the wall, you <sighs> doesn't it right. feel like uh, Markman is being pressured from two sides right now? Like both sides are like, help me get through this. I don't know what I'm doing. Help me, Markman. Mark, man, you are our expert, and they're pressuring him from both sides, and Mark can feel it, too. You could tell he's like, man, 
these ninjas don't know a damn thing. They're counting on me. And now he's saying all this shit, you know? That has to go. There can only be one guy that doesn't know shit. If there's more than one guy that doesn't know shit, it's going to be rough. It's going to be trouble. You're going to get a sandwich. Only one. He can be like the inquisitive noob. Like, I usually love Dota. And, you know, I have a concept of a competitive strategy. And I'm not a moron. Mark, take it away. Steve, Rip, take it away. You know what I mean? That would be way better. Love if you that. ask me, root for Arslan? Who's his opponent? Players. Jimmy J? <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> bud. Uh, I got bad news for you. I'm gonna root for Jimmy J. Thanks, Skelter, Helter, and Cyfex. And thanks, Jimmy Arrow to the knee. Dude, if Jimmy down. beats I mean, him, that means two Americans Americans beat Jimmy Arslan Ash. Hey, thanks, Zeta, NA, and Blanca Hater. Have a great day, will you? Hey, I will. Thanks, Matt1228. Uh, very, very strong. He's able to compete against the best players in the world. Anakin already clobbered him 6 0. So it's going to be interesting to see. But That's what I heard, at least. You better not hex him this time. I ain't hexing nobody, dude. I ain't hexing nobody. I ain't finna hex. I'm hexing the, the fucking. Not many people have that claim. He is such a surgeon when What do you call it? Presentation. That's all I'm hexing. My favorite part was the $50,000 checks in the background that kept on like swooshing by and the first prize is $7,000 for this. I like that part a lot. Pakistani Tekken community. I mean, does he have a lot of sparring practice there? A lot of good local talent? I mean, you don't really hear that often of Pakistani players coming and doing big things in the fighting game community. Actually, the spotlight's been on them more often now just because of Arsenal Ash. You know, it doesn't, I guess it doesn't matter whether or not those guys know what they're talking about. It's more about how it feels and how comfortable they feel. It doesn't matter. All that matters is how they, how they present present themselves and how it's perceived. How's your big Saturday going? They don't feel comfortable. They don't look comfortable. You know? And that makes Markman not look comfortable. Because he's not. Too much pressure. Hey, it's on. R Slam versus Jimmy. You know Jimmy was the closest to beating him at Evo Japan, I think. This is big. This is big history. Ouch. Already started. Magic 4. I'm sure they've played each other a lot at Ooh, Tech Roll. Didn't touch the wall. That's cheap. No tech that hits on the ground. What a character. Thanks, Roy. My big Saturday is going great. I'm doing very well. Mm, thanks, Nassau. Salem and Mac 1228. Oh gosh, mm -mm. he tried to sidewalk it. Just a little bit late. Oh, Damn, dude. He was way ahead of the game there on that low parry. That is so cheap. He looked extremely exhausted. Wow, unfortunate trade there. But he was still able to win that tournament too. Dude, he's getting his ass blasted to smooth the roots. Let's go, Jimmy. How the hell did Anakin beat him? You know, I talked to him right before this set even started, before we started checking out here, and I was like, how do you feel about this run back? He's like, you know, I felt like I played perfectly fine the first time. Good thing it was off stream. But this time, he's not even getting a chance to close it out. So I can keep making this dumb fucking joke. Stationary game coming from Arsenal and Ash, man. Nothing bigger than like a jab for some of these punishments. There's no evidence. He's pull the trigger at the right time, but this time the round, they control of my boy right now, Jimmy. Woof. Woof. Okay, okay. Oh, okay shit, didn't go for time. the mix up. Smart. Oh. Why risk it? He's okay. Just kill him. Don't get hit by the rage giant. Nice. Nice and simple. You know, it's very hard to punish if it does whip. So, safe option there from Jimmy J. Tran. Relatively safe option, I should say. Punish it. Wow. That was crazy. I want Jimmy to beat this hoe. Me too. Damn, dude. And get the pressure again, mm -mm. It makes it really strong. Punish it. Punish right there. Yeah, Do right. something. Really get a big punish though, so, right? So it's kind of okay for it to throw oh, that out. Oh, you got no health left, Jimmy's dude. Trouble here. He's trying to find that, trying to find a low crush that orbital heal, but he's got to guess and not guess Man. correctly. The mid from Arsenal Ash down forward one, the twin piston starter. So you guys Arsenal know who knee is, right? Uh, this is oh, basically man. the only guy who can consistently kick the shit out of knee. 
And Nee said the only way he knows how to beat this guy is to mix him up because his defense is too good. There's no other way to beat him. You have to mix him up with 50-50s, and that's not typically how Koreans like to win. They don't like to do that because it's riskier style. So that's in case you don't know who this guy is. He's good. What's going on? Now he has even more that was just to one game. What happened? Just doing Thanks, anything, newbie. Stopping him from getting out pace, getting those big counter hits. He's baited orbital so many successful times, and then the three plus four, four at certain ranges is not even there. Arsenal and Ash is so sharp right now. Let's talk yeah, about Jimmy got blasted. Ash came onto the scene. You know, obviously, he went out to Japan, got invited out there. Kuro Kuro ran a hey, bunch thanks. of I can't see Arsenal losing. Wow, you're a fucking clairvoyant. Amazing. Really, you're wasting your talents here. They need you out there. Uh, anyway, thanks. So, since he appeared on the scene at Evo Japan, he's got even more international experience. So he's got the power up, and then on top of that, just take that and like transfer it. What the fuck is going on, dude? Yeah, players like Chikorin going over to Pakistan, running those sets. What the fuck is this? The tone of everything. That those are history changes, right? Without a doubt, you're gonna put that seed in. Did they play one match or what? Look at those sweet fifty thousand dollar checks, dude. Let's see that more. Extending themselves. Sick checks. Helping the community grow. Yeah, and I gotta wonder, you know, what's going through Jimmy J's mind right now? You know, we talked. I would, I would get rid of those checks. If you guys are. Looking for, you know, I would, I would get rid of the checks. <coughs> Personally, I mean, that's a cool island. I like the island. Here we go. Nice intermission. Needed more bathtubs. This is the old versus the new guard, Arsene Ash. One game in, and this match, this can set him on the path to victory, especially on. Maybe that was an ad break. Was that an ad break? Man, that's fucked up. Mid match. Was that an ad break? No. Okay, oh my goodness. Still breaks the wall. Next wall. The down four one chasing. Nice confirm. Okay. And still trying to keep Arson really close to their wall. That was the one one that we were talking about. That standing jab has so much range. There's rage again. What tracking on that? The down four one. Beautiful stuff. Yeah, and yeah. He's forcing him to defend here. And it's so hard to get to the super Thank you. And this guy has been all over Jimmy. All over. It's like there are three of these guys. Sidesteps early out. Three on one match right now. I've just been like Jimmy's been getting fucked up. One two. There's a hatchet. That's all he's really been getting too, right? The hat, the low hatchet. That's it. You can't win around that way, and Arslan knows it. You can't kill me with just low hatchet kick. Okay, nice. Gobble up that jab. Thank you. Okay, we're gonna need a taunt something good right here, please. Oh, we're not ready for the tech on against the wall, though. Nice block goes for mid to answer back. Oh, what a over whip yet, over still here. Keeps the okay there you go. Three of them. Oh, oh yes, hit confirm machine gun punches. That's how it's done. Okay. It's like he won the whole tournament. I'm celebrating he got one fucking round. It shows how good this guy on the right is. Oh wow, whip punish again. Keeps the neutral ready for the whip punish, but still a series from Jimmy J Trent. Oh. Checking with the lows. Yeah, a lot of lows here. Mm -hmm. He wanted that shit again. He wanted to do the vacuum. <laughs> Tractor beam. Using that jab one more time. Oh wow, Jimmy looking prepared. I really like that crowd. This is fucked up, dude. Arslan is so good. He's like beyond. Uh, he's on another level. Everything that hits, it feels lucky. I told you, let's turn it. Jimmy G. It's turning. We almost got the U-turn. The beat also turning. Oh, man, Arslan, so good. I want the other corner. Down back to. Oh, well, he gave you both four oh, in one combo? Wait, wait, wait. I'm his biggest fan. Oh. He wants the spacing. You can oh. see him pushing. Nice whip punish on the monster. Oh, God, the it's tiger. It's okay. It'll go away. We'll left the gate open. Oh. Rage mode now available for Arsenal. If he can land a rage drive, he can't get to the wall very easily here. Gotta watch out against Kazumi. Looking for a dunk right there. The back one, a rarely seen move. 
I can't believe he's hitting so many buttons here. I can't believe this guy. Nice shit. Nice. That was good. Ha. Uh, Big Daddy West, thanks. And Combo Face, Ray Dog, uh, X Rev, Crunchy, Lord Worm. All right, time for an intermission. Everybody calm down. Mark Man is dressed up as Donkey Kong in a bathtub. And it's random. It's gonna be infinite as your no walls available. Yo, my dude is plugged <laughs> Thank into the Thanks, KN Cito. Hope everyone's oh feeling nice and loose. Walls, I mean, look, they haven't played a factor in Happy this big Saturday. Yet, but not. without a doubt, it's I'm it's excited. Right. I'm it's wagging my tail right now. Mm -hmm. But this is. Oh, man. Oh, man. There might be a drop on the stage. Might be, there's definitely a drop on the stage. Let me adjust my audio values. <laughs> All right, All right oh. final game. Jimmy Ooh, he missed the jet upper. That would have been nice. That would have really been nice. He's understanding you, right? He's putting together the pieces of what's happening. Get him, Jimmy. Processing, but you gotta believe Arslan's doing the same thing. Yes! Get him! Oh, he's mixing him up now. He was going for the con and open stage. Like, you know what, man? Forget it. Happy Fatty Saturday. Head braid by Cup Noodles. That's what Arslan stopped doing in the second game, by the way. The down for one. I wanted to point that out. Thank you. Really wasn't able to go down for one. Man, Arslan is so good. And look at this, Arslan. Bring it all the way back. Arslan is so good. Rage now. This first round, final game. Definitely a factor right now. He goes. Arslan is hella good. Pressure. Watch out for hers. With the jump back. Oh my god! Oh! oh! This is a 12 button! Look at the No! The second hit, you son of a bitch! Arslan is so good, Arslan is so good! Oh! He's good! He's good! The composure! The composure! Steve has none of it! Catch him out the air with the homing attack! Here comes Lars Nash to answer back! Okay, avoids the trample. My chair was backwards. I almost fell. Oh, with these side steps. Mm -hmm. I almost, like I almost old. fail. <laughs> Man, Steve's good. Beautiful down jab interrupt the fly. I would definitely hire him. Really comfortable with Oh yes. Really close range. <coughs> back off the side step. This one doesn't count. count. You're damn right he is. One round of peace. Damn, this is final gonna be fucking show. final, Luigi. Oh, what a back dash right there. Look how awake nice. Arslan Ash is. He'll take that damage all day. Mm -hmm. And Safe. that's the thing, right? Jimmy hasn't been blocking a lot of lows. Wow, the spacing. All the downward ones, so he's finally got a read correctly on one of these lows. Speaking of lows, that's what was in, it was important in opening up Arslan Ash. A lot of lows coming from Jimmy J. Tran changing his game. Yeah. Excuse I, me. I want to see Jimmy J go forth to counter the whiff that he, like he did. Oh, oh no! Brady this time with the whiff punish on the orbital. That was a really good whiff punish. Whiff punish that was so orbital good. Heal. Oh my oh, God! God. Why? Extra life to spare. Terrible at landing it. Oh! Oh! Fuck! Nice block. Oh! He didn't punish it, but he went with the low. Damn! Be cool. Over Jimmy J. Tran. Good block. Thank you. Here we go. There you go. Nice block! Nice! That could have been better. Oh! Oh! Why didn't you do that last time? Oh my god, dude! Arslan is hella good. Super good. Lots of time left on the clock. Jimmy should be Oh! This is so scary. Oh, the down back to the here we go, final. Steve. Hollow right number two, Red right Queen's right Ace. Thanks, Jimmy Gilbert, Sonic Blue Ninja, and that. Safuji. Lose the bracket action. Someone's going home. Oh, oh the God. Lock and the punish once again. Jimmy looking full throttle right now. Lots of dancing. I like the dancing. That's the spacing. Yeah, Jimmy's trying to bait out the whip punish attempt by Arthur, but Arthur, he's oh tight. He's come God. back. He's not going to fall for it again. Mm -hmm. Oh, that could have been way better. That was a really bad 1-1 one -one from Arslan. Oh, that's a punish. Good block. Oh, out of range. He does have a huge lead. Oh, yes. Not anymore. Oh, is so good. What a set. I'm not drinking no bath water. Let's go, Jimmy. Very nice. Anakin, and now, Jimmy J. Tran. USA! USA! Nice! Nice! We are going to have no voice for 
Nice! Damn! That was sick! Two US players! I'm excited. I'm oh man, he's so upset. That's fucked up. Look, I'm not laughing at him, but uh, you know, get fucking on, man. What are you gonna do? Welcome to the streets. That was sick. That was the most. That was one of the most difficult hexes I've ever placed. Now I was not confident. That was crazy. Was that final Luigi? When you got Steve standing up and pounding the desk like a savage in losers bracket round one. It was. That one match was better than like all the tournaments this whole year. Holy shit! Unbelievable. You know Jimmy J came this close from beating him at Evo Japan, and that was the tournament that put him on the map. Jimmy J was so close to beating him there. I ruined the documentary. <laughs> <laughs> the documentary. Oh. Hey, thanks, Trump, thick AF, and standards, uh, and everybody else. Man, we were ruining documentaries out here. No documentary. Damn, Jimmy J. Tran. That was crazy. Man, Brian is such a bitch character, dude. Brian is just the type of character to be able to beat a hoe of a character like Chun. Dude, you know what's so funny? Because uh, Jimmy J in Third Strike plays Urian. And Urian and Brian have that in common where they're like not the best character, right? They're not even top you know in the group of the best characters but that a good brian player under the right circumstances and a good urian player from third strike at least you know uh, under the right circumstances the cheap shit comes out and it doesn't matter what the matchup is you just do it orbital sucks you in agus reflector is unblockable <laughs> same fucking shit they really have a lot in common in this context where the potential to beat an S tier character is there because of tournament and the cheap shit. That full crouch mock kick, you know what it's, I don't know what it's called. Uh, that full crouch mock kick, that got him to win. That move is fucking horseshit. That move is horseshit. And so is Orbital and all that other trash. Northern Cross, whatever it is. Is, uh, that move is horseshit. Meanwhile, in the losers bracket, Anna that was crazy. Nice match. In the winners bracket, that was amazing. And the fucked up thing is, if Arslan Ash had been there for his first match, maybe he would have stood to get a better chance against Anakin. But because he wasn't there, Anakin kicked his ass and put him in losers, and uh, that was his last opportunity. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> for sure. In this matchup in particular, you know, wow. Junding's had a harder time, you know, adjusting, especially this year. You know, uh, last year he was the number two, I believe, on. Point. And it can beat so him so hard. hard. Yeah, I heard about that match. <laughs> I heard it was a total blowout. Disagree, but I don't want to sound too dumb on this broadcast. I mean, <laughs> no, I'm 100 percent on the knee tray myself. But it would be amazing to see that upset, as we've seen earlier today already. So uh, show me the upset. I'd love to see. He's it. not confident. Oh, yeah. That's a big we'll, problem. We'll He's supposed to be a host. Right you remember that guy that hosted? Uh, 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 what was that other thing? I forget what it was called, but it was on TV. Remember that guy, the bald guy? Ely, yeah. The guy who hosted Ely also didn't know shit, but he was confident in his ability to be a host, and he didn't really seem like he was uncomfortable with just going back and forth being inquisitive. I think that once, you know, everyone watching is an asshole, including myself. Self. So once you show them weakness, they're gonna feast, you know, and that's really like not what you even want. Yeah, Richard Lewis, that's his name. He's so funny. Mm, but what was I talking about? I forget what I was talking about, but I probably came to a conclusion already. You know, I never liked you. Oops, my bad. Hey, thanks. All right, rough first round for John that's Dick. That's okay. That's all right. That's all right. He was looking good at first. He just ran it back mm, a little insane. bit. He's insane. Yeah, that's what I was talking about. Man, yeah. 
This is a Damn. Punches that last I'm match, I'm still not over. I'm not ready for another match. Let's get a halftime show. For the mid option, I'd relax. Need giving him a little space, not expecting that second hit. John Dean's movement is going to be one of the most important things in this match. They could invite more actual Tekken right players there, to commentate. Yeah, that's what I suggested. But, I mean, you know, it's not that many more. One. <laughs> one more. So you could have a host, and then everyone else at least knows, you know, what they're about. Nice block. No punish. Gotta be careful. That blue stuff's coming. There it is. Okay, good block from John Ding. But the match quality is so good that it's almost at this point. Who gives a fuck? Go ahead. Hey, you guys are all doing a great job over there. Keep up the good work. They're so lucky the match quality is so good. Who cares? I don't give a fuck what they do. Markman could dress up as Predator. You know, who cares? Yo! I want a Predator, man. Thanks, Silent Green. And uh, I can't see Arslan losing. Thanks. And GG. Also, DJ Bustina and Josh Payne. <laughs> Righteous Bum. Uh, Scorpion the Hellsweet. And Tiki Y3. Thanks. <laughs> Damn. That was so sick. That was so sick. Okay. Does that movement again? Final round? Gosh. This is set point for me, but he's still moving. Still trying to get those big hits. Nice duck right there. Still finds the hit. This is probably going to be the wall for me. Big damage. Uh -uh. <laughs> Thank no. you. Man, I wonder what the fuck. How the hell did that happen? He missed his first match? Oh, that was a really good up four forward. And he's got him trapped in the corner corner. You know, that's just against the wall. Hey, thanks, round. Wizard, who has one. more okay, MP than HP, and Matt1228, Silent Breeze, and Koi Flow. If Koreans are dragons, what makes Arslan? What makes Arslan? Hey, greetings from America, Koi Flow. What makes Arslan? Hmm, hmm, hmm. And John Ding has the lead right now to close out the first game, but can he hold on? Nice block on the down two. This is actually one of those things that people oh, say about yeah. Steve Austin. Oh. Thank you. That it's hard for him to make a comeback when he's behind on life. Oh, exactly. nice. What? Oh, 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 counter hit as well. Is that enough this damage? Not enough. Not enough cash. Oh, oh my oh, god. Gosh. Wall, he's Thanos. Oh, he's really, really far. Oh, the oh, ultimate. Oh, can definitely make this Four happen. hits. Oh, oh my God. God, that's not Damn, legal. He is too good. You that's with fucked the up. And he took your whole life far. Show me wow. that bathtub. He's wow. too good. That's only one game. Oh my gosh, man. That was so unlucky that the combo was not enough damage to kill for John in that situation. And me, man. What a comeback. I was talking about it. You know, when Steve Fox Thanks, behind the Mr. Light, like that much, he needs <laughs> I don't like out. your name. So Thank you. Buttons, uh, cool, Dev. Thanks very much. Life come back on you, right? Yeah. So he's got to use these down twos, these down ones, the albatross down two, down back three to get you towards the Yo! Tano snapped his finger. Hey, thanks, Ness Al Salam. <laughs> and Kachuchin Sama. Thanks. Let me see more of those $50,000 checks in the back I keep hearing about. Let me get one of those. The winner of this wins 7500 bucks, by the way. And they decorated the background with $50,000 checks. Nice. 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 <laughs> hmm. Thank you. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, hey, thanks, Chinese name. And thanks, Mitch the Human. Jimmy Juggernaut Tran. Thanks, Wheelchair OBSF. Appreciate it. I don't blame him. Coming out strong here. Game two. Low pair once again. Tries to make him go for the quick guess. And he says, no, bro. 15,000 for the winner? Oh, maybe I'm repeating the uh, prize pool for Soul Calibur. I assumed it would be the same for Soul Calibur. My bad. 15, how much did you say? 15,000? No, it's 7,500. 
Uh, is that, did that guy who okay. just said that, is that guy working wow, over there or something? The cap, he's like, he hey, why did you say that if it's, uh, 15k is the whole prize pool? Uh, enjoy big dinner. Thanks, Akuma Tata. Thanks. It's 15k among all the players, I think. So that's 7,500 for the winner. Um, you know, but if you add all that together, it's, it's pretty much 50k. If you think about it, if you do enough fat bong rips, it's pretty much 50k. So it totally makes sense. Wow. Stays on the ground. Down two to try to start some pressure. Mid out of relax. Rage mode now for John D. Can he find a way to land this without getting countered by C? Oh, oh, he does! Wow. That the walk's right the there, though! Wow. That was scary. That was a little scary. Thanks, level 333. Three, three. Sometimes the walk pushes him off. You don't get the last hit. But John didn't get to that. His connecting flight one. made him late. Yeah, now. that sucks. That really sucks, man. I mean, he must be really disappointed, you know? He came all the way over here. He had the opportunity to play these good players and stuff. I'd be disappointed, but I mean, next week's Evo, he's, he's going to be fine. I'm sure he'll do great there. But, I mean, you know, regardless of all that dumb shit I just said, get fucking owned 2-0 by U.S. players. Oh, lucky. Didn't get You know? Got to get away from that wall now, though. Eddie, not the best at sidestepping. Simple as that. Fighting alongside that wall for quite some time now. The same answer three times after that move has been oh, whipped. Go man. for the mid. He just not. He just cannot <laughs> up knee right now. <laughs> knee. He had the option to come back, but doesn't pull the trigger. And just like that, set point. Hennigan didn't even lose a round. To stay on the I didn't know that. I hadn't made that up yet. Nice. GG's oh, Anakin. Getting him the desired effect right now. Impressive. Down once again, not finding his mark. You see much less low parries out of knee, respecting John Ding. Yeah, you do slow moves that really come on, John. I never even he's heard of this guy. Thank you. Big lead Johnny John D, Ding. get like this motherfucker. Risky. Testing knee. Why test knee? You know he's gonna know about it. Jab into up knee now. Wall pressure coming. And like I mentioned, Steve, once he gets up that wall, wow. the down back three comes into play. Like a real boxer, man. You gotta be careful. Oh. He's lucky that got blocked. He's who? Poking his way back into this now. The sweep. Mm. Oh, High risk. But he, like he should have it. Turns. It John should be enough. Ding. Yeah. <gasps> does that work with Steve and Paul only? Who else does that work with? Oh, I guess Yoshi and... Does that work with all those characters? This guy is Thanos. Show the bathtub. Why are they showing John Ding? He lost. <laughs> it's like uh, the bloodied photo. Incredible. That was ridiculous. I did not know. I didn't know. I didn't know. Claudio, yeah, I that's another like, one. Damn, that, yeah, that, that was, was fucked up. up. I know what the. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow, so we are tied up. One game apiece. John Ding is playing fantastic in this set, right? I mean, I was a little scared he's going to throw it away at the end again there. You know, he's down the wire. Uh, he had a big lead. Same thing was happening. He was bringing it back, chopping away, man, chopping that tree down. Look, if you can tell. Right now, John Ding made some crazy changes playing a lot I'm doing great. Late. Ran in, down 4-2 to start the game. Uh -huh. Counter hit all worked out in his favor, and that led to <laughs> him getting a full match right now. So Nia is thinking, like, what do I do now? He's going to have to respect him a little more. Hey, no, I'm feeling great. 100 bucks. What about you guys? What happened? Did I misspeak? I hope I didn't say the N-word. Not again. John Ding hit him with the slip kicks. That's that was close enough for him right. to get the clean hit. He'd been fishing for that since the first game. <laughs> if I did, it was an accident. I promise. <laughs> I was playing for honor, and you know. <laughs> uh, thanks, Dusty Marlowe and Kizek, and thanks TC Rooks and Casey and Neville and everybody else. That game for honor really. <laughs> Never mind. That game fucking sucks. Just back dashing away, keeping it simple. And down 4 1, taps him on the leg, <laughs> and tries to get away. And you can see John Ding playing a lot more confident in his spacing. And then you look at the movement. Oh, still uh -huh. down 4 2, he's gonna hit the wall. <laughs> yes, sir. Uh -huh. Hey, yeah. smile. Oh, down 4 2 to answer back. Life lead in favor of Knee right now. They're pretty close to this wall, and you know Knee don't mind. Oh, 
wow, how can that even connect? I'm not sure. Maybe I didn't. I thought that was always clean hit. Wow, delayed and hit confirmed. Nice and done by me. Oh, he's, he's swinging. He's definitely swinging. Oh no, 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 Damn. And John Ding, man, he had to, he had to read. And that's something that John Ding does, though, right? He likes to go for his rage at the end. And I feel like they're unnecessary. Just take him out of the game, bro. Like, you don't need to have, land them. I feel like he misses them, and it costs him the game. Hey, thanks, AVJ Raz. Can't, can't <laughs> thanks very much. Thank you. Yeah, it's a very big risk. That's the second hit whip. Go rip. And I feel like the pressure is getting to John Ding right now. He's, he's getting a little impatient, trying to rush in there a little too hard. And that's exactly what Steve Fox wants. Because once you start going in there, running and hitting buttons, the, da the back one's coming through. The down four two is coming through. And look at me. He's playing defensive. Like, look, I'm blocking. I promise Damn, I Rip's going a you. mile a minute. He's finishing these strings, and it's throwing me off. He's getting mm -hmm. hit by a bunch of these finished strings that you typically don't see. It's working out in John Ding's favor. What an it Hit confirm again. Punish. John Ding fishing a little too hard. One plus two break. Get off me. Almost 10 seconds left on the clock. Oh! Wow, that oh, was sick. Is it enough damage? Oh, yes. wow, man, I thought oh, it was going to be a Thanos. Again. All right, tied up with round counts again. All that Whoosh. movement. That's what that back dash can't do. Hey, you think they're, they're going to take a break? That was what about so taking a win? Oh. And with punished it? With the race drive? Oh, wow, got him to duck? John, hey, you got Thanos to duck? You know how many times you gotta dab on Thanos to get him to duck? Hell no. Damage on that combo, that was half life. Dude, John Ding. John Ding kick his fucking ass. Simple as that. You are looking like you're. he's looking like he's on fire. We just talked about what John Ding needed to do. John Ding. He wanted to be the next generation, right? He needs to put. He needs his name on his belt. He needs to be able to take out a player like me. Definitely. Whoa. And as everyone mentioned, had a rough. That was interesting. The first hit whiffed. Yeah. But look at this, John Ding. He's back. Oh shit! That's fucked up, man. He's good. That was Wait, fucked up. Available. That was like an option Dang, select in case he does the extension. He'll get the flow combo. If he doesn't do the extension, the jab will recover and he can still again. deal with relax. Oh, it's fucked up. Right out of the gate. Big lead income for John Ding again in the final round. Can he hold on again? Corner pressure. This is Eddie's strong point. We've seen what that movement can do. Oh my god. god. This is Eddie's strong point. Oh, interrupt again. Oh, that's fucked up. He's like just hitting him out of all the. Oh! He did the dumbest shit, dude. That is tight. Oh god, it's not over. Oh my god. Man. Where's the wall? Oh Ding. Oh! 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 It was so close. That it was, was crazy, dude. And again, what a good match! Wow, John Ding just letting it slip away. Me, this me, this me. game really what is, is good for spectators. How the hell Jackson did they seven. manage to do WSOE that? Seven. That was awesome. Oh, crazy. This destiny. Take oh. it seven. Man, Steve needs to wear a seatbelt. They got a mandatory seatbelt on this guy. You know, they got to put him in one of those child seats. He gets out of the seat and he runs amok in the back seat. You know? We got we to gotta strap him down. Sit down. You can't even tell he's standing up. <laughs> he's almost rips height. Are you kidding me? <laughs> hey, AR2077 and Seloy Dan. Thanks. Andy is dead. Desperado, Jedi wow, Nate, and everybody else so that so likes my stream. Yeah. Mayo, I mean, uh, I mean, you look at uh, Kofi. John Ding was playing out of his mind. He mm. had the lead. So many times. I hope I didn't miss anyone. If I did, sorry. I appreciate it. Slow mode feature was the icing on the cake. Hey, thanks, Bustin' Nut. Muchos Garcias. Insane. No wonder they call Hey, you think this is going to be an intermission? I think I have to pee. In that last round, he came out These matches have been so good. Three, two, three, two, three, two. Woo. Final round, final game. Are you kidding me? And that's only the winner's bracket semifinals. We have so much more. There's so such a huge difference in the tone in their voices, too. Bracket run. <laughs> We're not going to want to miss it. The one on the right of Mark Van has a really deep voice. And the one on the left has a really high voice. <laughs> it's a crazy contrast. If I was Mark Man, I'd be like dizzy, you know? I don't know what to expect. Oh! Piss time. All right, look, I only got three minutes. I'm gonna be late, okay? So, you know, maybe they'll show you some bath water or something. But I'm gonna be late. Don't worry about it. I gotta take a piss. Be cool.
Growing up in America was just like an opportunity in itself, right? To live in the greatest country in the world where truly you are free and you the get so many opportunities to kind of make your own way hey, in hey, life. Seven, 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 like seven, 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 American dream, I guess you could say. I mean, it's only, it's like something that I think about a lot, just representing, you know, I'm from Atlanta, so when I compete either domestically, internationally, I'm always representing my hometown, and I'm always already representing America against international level competition. So this is like something that's very official, and you got one representative per country, so it's kind of like the Olympics of Tekken, I guess you could say, and it's something that I really, really get really excited about. And as we take a look into Anakin's excitement to represent USA for the United States Esports Federation at the Tekken World Championships later this year in Seoul, Korea, this December, it's not over yet. Now, not only are they <laughs> playing for the <laughs> title you. of World of WSOE ch Championships, the highest placing American will represent. And Anakin is not the only one remaining. Jimmy J. Tran also on the loser side. And here's a twist. If they both move, the, if they lose the next match, they're gonna end up in fifth. And Kim they will play a head-to-head seven, 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 so much on the line there. Thank you so much, KP, for bringing it all in for us. Man, what a story there is. What stake there is at WSOE 7. The opportunity to fly to Asia, to fly overseas, and for the first time in years, represent Team USA, your country. Are you kidding me? And probably like a sick tracksuit, you know? Maybe, I, I would I would hope. assume that would be the case. At least an America cape. Let's be a honest. Cape, at least, yeah. at a minimum. Yeah. American Everybody flag, right? The full-blown flag. Of course. Okay, good, good. I mean, of those two representatives that are there, I mean, between Anakin and Jimmy J. Tran, they're some both of the swaggy, best players. Bro. Some of the best players that America has to offer. And they both have swag. That's the thing. So, yeah. honestly, both of them would look with that cape. So, I'm, I'm torn. Poof, I made it. Who I want there. They didn't it. play so, it, we'll did they? If Anakin on your Did I miss anything right cool? Do it with a big win and a big upset. Going to be tough to do, of course, against his Korean opponent. And it looks like Jazz Hands is ready to go here. We got. Yo, the right. losers bracket uh, thanks, Kiwami, Kijo, and Gold. Thanks, DJ Bustin' Up, Mateo. What up, dude? Yeah, thanks. Yeah, Are you going to Evo? You better be. Oh shit. Actually, one of those matches where Anakin does very well against the. Is this a rematch or a, a recording? We haven't seen Lohai's Law be this good. Mm -hmm. That's definitely true. No, this is live, right? They're good, right? We all seen this character being played out in season two. <laughs> Thank you. A lot of representation. It's on. They're on. Yeah, I mean, exactly. himself as well. I think it was back in uh, Infinite final stage. Round, maybe Get out of there. This is good for Anakin, even though he's getting this fucked up and probably going to die right long. here. Nope, and he's still alive. Barely. Nah. Oh! Oh! Oh my god. Final mix up. Ah, uh, high crush. Thanks, Alibaba is here and Boozy. Thanks for the sub. A little scary. A little high. Yeah, that was really close. I mean, Anakin the really bug? All the way back. They don't say the Anakin bug. They so say debug. Short for debugger. Yeah, when Law does that punch break, Not I the bug. Yeah, <laughs> V-Bugs. <laughs> I'm going to start calling it that. V-Bugs. I like that. V-Bugs. <laughs> Nice. Right, nice. You guys invented oh, shit. Alright. Damn, he's doing that shit. The neutral. Standing still. Neutral guard. It's dangerous. There you go. Don't let him do it. That's confidence. Get rid of that confidence. <laughs> Alright, look at this round me right now. This life lead, I mean, excuse me. That punch? Forward one plus two? That punch for law, he can end in crouch or standing. That is pretty fucked up, if you ask me. Because while standing four is a frame trap that you can only sidestep out of in one direction, and if you end standing, he has all kinds of options. See, it's just such a good move. You're gonna see it a shitload. It's a really good move. And if it counter hits, it gives you a full combo, big combo. Keeping the pressure on now. Oh. There he goes again. That's like one of his tournament moves, you know? 
law. He's got a lot of moves, but you can't just be doing everything. You got to use the best shit, and that's a really good turn on his move. Gotta be careful. Low high gets wild sometimes in around, man. Punish that. Beautiful between the cheeks. He didn't want to fuck with this guy doing the third hit. He hit him right between. Beautiful. Anakin's bringing it back. Yo, Anakin must be feeling good. Look at the uh -oh. magic yeah, four. You good, you hit a bunch of Here's a magic four for you. Ah. I ain't dropping this time. That was such good space. That was cool. Oh, nice wait stuff. a minute. Man, a boy. Anyone's and game. Oh, that was the biggest whiff ever. What the fuck? Oh, my. Oh, God. This might be enough. I don't think it is. Nah, hell no. Running mix up. The mid? Oh, the double mid! First he beats Arslan, and now he's up a game. Ooh, snarling? Woo! Damn, licking his lips? Is he gonna turn this ninja into a sandwich? He looks hungry. Is he a sandwich? I think he's gonna eat him. Can I get this done with Law? Law is actually very good against Jack. However, did you see him snarl like that? Lohai's best character is his Shaheen, and instead he picks something completely different. Fifty thousand dollars. Fifty thousand. Look at all those smiles in the background, smiling, holding up their fifty thousand dollar checks. Against Anakin's Jack. Good strat, good strat. Wow, and we're gonna go to the Mission Madojo for game two. I've never seen <laughs> a new character against Anakin. I'm very interested to see how this one goes. Whoa, Lohai switched to Kazumi. I don't think anyone on Earth is rooting for him now. Boo! I've never booed so hard in my life. You know, switch to Kazumi. At least, you know, Law is fun to watch and respectable. And I don't even believe I'm saying that. But at this point, he is. Oh, God. Compared to Kazumi, hell no. Oh, God. He's lucky he didn't stick. Okay. Come on. Get him with the V-Bucks. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, Janetti. Uh, four Alchemist. Mm, anonymous, thanks. And Ravenous Tomato. Damn, the ducking jackhammer, dude. I like that. Thank you. Yeah. Excuse me. Thanks, you fish. Oh my god, dude. What a cheap character. Damn! That was sick. That was super tight. <laughs> Blue stuff, huh? Get rid of it. Jackhammer! Blackjack! Already gone. Look at Loa, a couple posties right back in it. Mm -hmm. back to for that oh man. That could have been a lot worse. Low that crush. Too, I was just talking about. Yeah. There it is again, just to keep him on his toes. Yeah, Jack, a difficult character. This must be a really him. bad oh, fight. Oh! oh! Like, oh yeah? It's gonna hurt. Oh, it's gonna hurt, it's gonna hurt but not enough cash. The biggest mix up! Why did you do something so risky? Oh, my God. oh so risky. Yeah. Maybe. But still, too risk. Oh, God. Yeah, that was too risky. It, maybe he's right. He wanted to use a low that was a little weirder so the low parry would get fucked up, but still, not, not worth it. That's what I was talking about. Just making sure you can keep Jack in line is something Kazumi's really good at. Loha knows that. Ooh. You see it's happening in these later rounds. First match, but a later round still. Four, two, one, Not a boy. He wants the magic four. But look at Anakin just fighting his way back Too into short. this game right now. Oh, oh. Nice. The blue one. Okay. Oh, the oh yes. Anakin yes. Be cool. Be cool. This, could be it. this, this could guy be Arslan? Right yeah, dude, isn't that crazy? That's big. Because if this goes to the wall, he's poised. He's poised. He's poised. Oh! Okay, who cares about that? Anakin still has the lead. 
She's in rage. Don't cross the flake, Steve. Mm -hmm. Hey, did you see that? That was so sick. USA. Damn. Six inch, foot long, low high sandwich, please, and a bag of flaming hot Doritos. Damn, he's good. Delicious. Delicious. Six inch, foot long, please. Oh, man. Nice. Oh, man. Damn, he was snarling. Uh, you can't snarl like that and lick your lips and then lose. <laughs> Thank you. That was tough. Hey, thanks, Biscuit. Uh, Eskandari. Thanks, Mystic Forge. And everybody else. I appreciate that. Of course, a great match up there as... Anakin shows some ice in his veins after getting kind of embarrassed in winner's bracket round two against JDCR, another Korean, goes against Damn. Ohio and does a phenomenal That was sick. Oh, yeah, and just a very strong showing from just how strong of a player he is. And you can see how everything kind of shapes nice. up. Nice, Jimmy J and Anakin. You mentioned he had that tough match against JDCR earlier. Uh, JDCR actually waiting in the winner's final where he's going to be facing off against me. We like to call this match Battle of the Gods. <laughs> so I'm Indeed, looking forward to that. It is. Anakin looks like a bigot. Video, but <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, he's been low high many times in the past, so I'm excited to see this. But the next matchup oh, as well. Is. The oh. next matchup is gonna be fun. Mr. Swag himself. I love this guy. Yo, you kind of have a point. <laughs> I never noticed that. <laughs> I never noticed that about him. That was awesome, dude. Going up. That was yeah. awesome. The one that really did a good job sticking it to me, Jean Ding. Hey. Really surprising how well he did. Hey guys. Me. Do you think that gives him an advantage here? On the, oh, um, all right. You know, I, don't I thought they were throwing it over to her. Thing about these two players that are going against each other. I think Jimmy's going to have his number. It's going to be really, really tough for Jundin. It's going to be a great matchup, that's for sure. Before we jump into that one, though, we have the wonderful and the beautiful Lauren Jabara for an update on the main stage. Wonderful and beautiful. Tosses to me today, Fallout. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. Well, we is know this delay me? I'm going to refresh. The WSOE... Money, money. First place going home. It's still delayed. I think it's not me. Hundred dollars. It's pretty exciting. Second place gets twenty five hundred dollars. Third going home with fifteen hundred. Fourth, one thousand. Fifth and sixth time for seven fifty. And seventh and eighth going home with five hundred dollars each. Fifteen thousand dollars total. And then on top of that, we have those bounties that we're going to be talking about in a little bit. Oh, yeah, I like that also, idea. They have bounties kind of like how the UFC does fight of the night and Come submission on. of the and night and all that. Wins, okay? They have and bounties that, for like a couple G's or something. The player here today is going to be representing the U.S., the entire country at the Tekken World Championships in Seoul, South Korea. It's going to be pretty cool. Lots that these people are competing for. Lots to still unfold. <laughs> Sending it back to you guys, Fallout. Thank you so much, Lauren. And yep, lots to unfold, including not just that prize pool, but we got some bounties as well, which we talked about. Ooh, the guy's the name show, is Fallout. Bounties, of course, are still up That's his red. handle. But when they throw it over to Fallout, Fallout you know, it always throws me off. Maybe they should go first name. I don't know. It's kind of weird, dude. I'm not an expert at this kind of thing, but from a from my perspective, I feel like the. The set looks so nice. It looks just like such a professional, really, like, tight and organized operation. But then the end presentation feels really loose. It really gives you the vibe of, like, yeah, like kids are having fun. It's like they're doing a... They're, bring your kids to work day and all the grown-ups thought it would be cute if like their kids tried it tried and saw how they could do it you know in even other parts of Asia, like ESPN, bring your kids to work day type of shit. But I don't know. I'm, maybe I'm just a hater. Hey, didn't that shut down? Yeah, unfortunately. <laughs> yeah. That could also be true. I mean, is it still big in South Korea? I mean, everyone's, I mean, I, I think for the most part, arcade scenes are dying down around the world. Everyone's PC starting to play at home. They're playing on console. They're playing on PC. I liked E-League's presentation. Right I thought it had a little bit of like tightening up to do but overall i thought it was smooth and it felt comfortable 
we're looking at that face right there. That's the key. I think the people that are involved, they have to be com confident and comfortable. And if you have too many people in there that don't know about the game, they're going to have to lean on... They're going to have to be sipping on that lean, and they're going to lean on the guys that do know about the game. So that's how you end up getting that uncomfortability sandwich with Markman as the meat. J. Tran versus John Ding. Okay, here we go. You know? This is the classic, man. This is the Jimmy J versus Johnny D. Where Eris is on commentary. Gave the crowd the STFU. Oh, yeah, that's right. Everybody shut the fuck up out there. Do you remember that? John Ding was fighting against Jimmy J. Tran. And Jimmy was beating up Jong Ding, and the whole crowd was being so loud, cheering against Jong Ding. And then he fucked him up and shut everyone up. And I told everybody to shut the fuck up. That was tight. I feel like he just stole that from Arslan mid-set. He's like, man, that was Because I can he hear all those NorCal bitches screaming, yeah, NorCal. Jong Ding shut them all up. Already. That was tight. Once again, Jimmy is just looking like he is already a grand finals right now. He look, he's he's trying to get there right now. I mean, he has to win this set just to play Anakin for that USA. Yeah, season. Jimmy J, Johnny D. So, yo, my boy John Dane still controlling it though. Mm -hmm. Man, can you believe Jimmy beat Arslan? And it was a final round situation. That was incredible. Incredible. Now, Arslan is so good. All that shit I was saying while I was kidding, I meant it. That guy is super good. I think that if he doesn't make Evo top eight, that's crazy. Who's gonna beat him? Other than several U.S. players, Anakin, Jimmy J. Who knows? Other than them, though. Awards? Yeah, I think Awards has this. Yeah, you got this, Awards. Hey, thanks, Armored Cutie and Alkina. And thanks, Gotoro and Biscuit. How was he aware of that? He was still so prepared to deal with it. definitely done that before to someone else. You know, he was ready for that situation to unfold. Down back to and that's the level of the game we're getting to, right? Like these crazy situations, like oh, I got him sideways at the wall off this weird wall angle. Yeah, down, that's gonna, gonna hurt. That move down back two, I think it is for Brian. That move is very good against relax handstand. A lot of the time when Jong Ding goes in to relax, he can't push a button, and he knows it because if he does, that move is gonna float. But if he just stays down, it's just gonna hit once. So it's really fun. Up, actually. It's pretty good. Apologies if you answered this already, but are you streaming next weekend or will you be at Evo? I'll be at Evo. <laughs> Thanks, random dude. Uh, and Mr. Demonic. I'm leaving next Thursday and coming back next Monday. So the last stream will be on Wednesday, and I won't stream again until the following Tuesday. That was that was I heard. I thought we were going to a final round situation like we have been all day. But man, John Ding closing it out three rounds to Sheesh. one there over Jimmy J. Tran. Just like that. John Ding feeling good. He's, he's doing magic tricks dude, up there he's, with his hands. Dude, he's one of those guys you can see it visibly when he's feeling really, really Was good. Was this losers? Gameplay. Three rounds to one. Oh, man. And that's that back and forth counts on, uh, not only in the round count, right? In the life bar, there's a lot of oh, back yeah. and forth. There's no block damage. No. So you're seeing mostly pokes. That's a great point. Oh, yeah. It has he to. does not have chip damage except for like very situational yeah. things, right? Like very few characters have projectiles. Otherwise, you got to be in like a key charge stage to do chip damage. Yeah, it is. Or you got to have like a rage guy that pushes him against the wall to do chip damage. Mm -hmm. Do you need to get tickets for finals? Hey man, I don't really know any kind of information, but I'm pretty sure you do. I can't imagine you can just walk into finals. It's limited seating. Oh my god, Jimmy, that was such a good bait. Look at the big life lead here. Oh, come on. He could have punished that. John Dane trying to find an opening. Those jabs are getting so much done for Jimmy right now. Damn, that was far. Nice. Hey, nice. Thanks, Globehead and Mr. Demonic. Thanks, guys, and Armored Cutie. He does get guaranteed follow-up. Happy big Saturday. You know when it's done. Just like right there. My boy Jimmy. Counter hit. 
-huh. Let's go all the way to the wall. Jimmy, J. Uh -huh. Plant. That was a J. <laughs> hey. Oh, shit. Thank you. Uh -huh. Jimmy, okay. Jimmy, please. I know you're upset about that. That was pretty match. wild. Yeah, look, man, you had it. He had a pixel. He made the comeback, but that's uh, a man little. Thanks, hey, right? Six Machine. Let me play a little bit in the second game. Hatch. Oh, God. Damn, big yeah. trade. And he's nice. Ooh. Back to the and he's gonna get the wall again. Uh, Jimmy, Jimmy. Damn, look at this fucked up combo. This right character's right good. Two rounds to none in the second game. <laughs> Slowly. Thank Hatch you. Kick. There's a jab. Oh, John Dink still has a chance. Now in rage. Oh, uh -huh. you can't be whipping like that. Jimmy, he was waiting for anything like that. He ran all the way for the whip punish. Excuse me. You want to give him a space. Knows that he needs something big to close out. All right, that was kind of Three an easy back. game. I know you noticed what happened in that last Jimmy game. Jimmy J. I got me around, but uh -huh. what about now? Three that was rounds clean. so clean. I mean, Jimmy's like, dude, what was I even doing in the first game? Let me show you what I meant to do the first game. That was impressive. He was so confident. Even that final round, he had the huge life. He's like, I can't even blow this. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do whatever I want, and you're dead. <laughs> And you can tell, that's another thing you can tell about Jimmy. That movement gets a lot more free form. Finishing a lot of those strings, getting those <laughs> counter hits, especially just calling up. You're right, John Steve hasn't, hasn't been singing, has he? The I wonder what's up with that. For, right? He's got I wonder if they put on a no singing rule. That would be cool. That John Ding is going to swing is getting him matches. One of the things we haven't seen from Jimmy that I really love in his gameplay that he's added over the last <laughs> year or two. <laughs> Thank you. Like sidestep into crouch dash while standing. Thanks, like bacon farmer and fun <laughs> pie. I hope he pulls it out. And I love thanks, it. But here we go. Zaya X. The last match of this set right here. Here we go, Jimmy J. Tran, John Ding. The score is one one. This is on the loser side. Somebody's going home. Oh shit, home. we're on Sook. Yeah, <laughs> but here we go. <laughs> we're on that Sook. <laughs> Do you, you have kebab right with fries there, in USA? USA? Kebab with fries? Hey, thanks, Private Doncopter. Not where I live. I don't really even know what you could mean. It depends on what kind of kebab you mean. Because in the USA, we have all different types of people. So you got all kinds of different kinds of kebab. You know? But... Look at these mm. jabs. You talked about Maybe we do. Not where I live. Look at what it's doing for him. But, oh, Shish. Yeah. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. Shish. The Shish coming. Well, uh, I don't know of any places where you can get some good chips and Shish. I don't know where you can get good chips and Shish, but uh, I'm sure there's something. So it's worth it to throw it out and kill the clock with it. Jimmy J. Pan, first round here in the final game. Rodeo. Yeesh. No break. Wolf's tail. Ooh. Damn, everything is whiffing. Okay. Hit this time. He's fishing okay. real hard. Hopping the combo. Harris combo coming through. Trying to adjust for the wall. Mm -hmm. That's exactly what I was about to say. Sook Madik. And right now, they're just dancing. I like that one. And that wall Sook space is definitely going in favor of John Ding right now. Yeah. The life Excuse me. Down 4-2, no counter hit. Jimmy needs to be careful right now. This is still the final game. Oh boy, this is scary for John Ding with smart Yikes. stuff. Keeps it nice and safe. One round piece. Here. That's the final full game. name of this marketplace in Arabic. And for Jimmy, a lot more on the line. Beautiful low parry. As much carry as possible right here. Uh -huh. Oh boy, no. Oh, Jimmy already accounted for the move. Side steps to the left. <laughs> sharp. Not a Thank you. Damn, that move has whiffed a shitload already. Still ready. No check roll again from John Dick. Small combo on the wall there. He is in rage, mm -hmm. though. Yeah. Oh, not oh, yes. Looking good here for Jimmy. The Beautiful. Close it out. Thanks, Set Twisted Spiral for Jimmy J. and Lex Lung and Geo Gotti. He needs to stop this pace. Thanks, guys. Thanks Jimmy again, Private Doncopter. I want to see the rodeo. Wow. Man, like, I know you're gonna man that is Here's some bullshit, dude. That move is so fucking Small good. It's got a tractor beam built in. Did you see that sidestep? Man, Jimmy's pretty good. I got to give it up. I tell him that when I see him. Hey, you got pretty good. Oh, I can't believe you pulled the trigger on it one more time. John Ding on the ropes. Goes for slip kicks. Not close enough to get the clean hit. That means no combo. Orbital once again. 30 seconds left on the clock. That down back to just to knock him away. Stuff the mix up. Rage mode for John Ding. 
Oh man. He's about to pull some shit right here. Here comes the blue stuff. Damn, Steve's having some kind of issue. Damn. He's still alive. Oh, the toke! Oh, that wasn't even a punish? Dude, why has it gotta be final Luigi every time, dude? Damn, he got the jab! Good start. That's a good start. Look at this fucking combo off a jab. Into all press. Damn, he's fighting his way out of the corner. Watermelon section of Suk Madik. Oh, hatchet. Watermelons, watermelons. Oh, what an immediate check on Relax. Yeah, he's got his back to the wall, but he hasn't been able to take advantage of it, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, boy. Like, go. Oh, oh, what a big whip. Oh, oh shit. Not prepared. Goes for the mid. Oh, come on. Nobody has a ring. Oh. Oh, 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 Jimmy J. Tran. Man, Jimmy is on a streak. Wow. Damn. That was tense. That was very tense. Well, that was very guys, tense. But Jimmy J. Tran nice. is going to be the one to come out on top. Once again. Nice shit, I USA. That these guys meet up multiple times throughout the years. They get consistency on their thanks. side. They want Easy there, day. They uh, You're looking at history thanks. right now. And Twisted Spiral, thanks again. Back, and I know who won. I saw it with my that own eyes. And you can see it here on, on the bracket. bracket on hey, the there are no now, Europeans in this tournament, huh? Right at that loser are there any? Match, oh, yeah, there was a French guy. He won uh, Soul Calibur. But there are no European Tekken players in this. What's up with that? Let's get a Super Akuma in here. <laughs> Thank you so much, boys. Much appreciated. And wow, do you guys know what this means? Those two. Maybe they tried and it wasn't possible. Now play each other. Not only kind of the playoff here in the losers bracket, but also they're racist. To represent mm. team I don't know if you know this, but Europe is in a race. Federation, of course. You can register for anyway. At e no big deal. Or you can get your own gamer pass. But wow, so much at stake here in this upcoming oh Olympics shit matchup. I know Anakin wants it more than anything. Oh, this is the most oh, intense woo! battle that we've seen. Oh, slash and here you cast. Oh, oh, and it was it was that was it. Was oh, damn, <laughs> everyone was watching. <laughs> playing and cast it's the fight before the fight next level shit right there wow sure Incredible. next level absolutely next level we got anakin on screen right now get ready to go live against jimmy j tran battle of the americans in the losers bracket again the winner will be going on to play on team usa in seoul korea for the world championships wow so much at stake and i'll tell you right now you're not gonna want to miss this one we'll be right back with some break wsoe seven how episode. long team america Opportunity of a lifetime. We'll see who will come out on top. All right, I'm going to go take a whiz. If I'm late, you know, whatever. It's not 10 minutes, is it? Two minutes? All right, I'll be right back. Be cool. Welcome back to WSOE, brought to you by DollarShaveClub.com. We have everything you need in the bathroom. Respawn, live to play another day. Fleetwit, play <laughs> Fleetwit, Mierda. Fleetwit today. You know what time it is? Seven 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 to play some Tekken. Let's take a look. Craziest thing that I've blown off for Tekken would be just about anything you can name. <laughs> I quit call. I dropped out of college, quit my job, and you know, back even before that, I would like skip homework. I would skip school to go to the arcade and play Tekken. It was just like the only thing that I wanted to do. 예전에 이제 초콜라다가 제가 주변 사람들 결혼식에 좀 많이 못 갔었는데 그게 대부분 이제 게임하다가 늦게 자서 다음날 못 일어나서 못한 적이 좀 있습니다. 아, uh, I uh, there was one event in Korea, a major event. 
second World Tour event in Korea last year in, I, I think it was like, like April. I skipped <laughs> yeah, my you. friend's wedding for this. I remember I was, it was a tournament online for Tekken Tag Tournament 2, and I had work that day, but I was still in the tournament, and I was like in the top eight for it. So I called off of work because I wanted to win that, um, that tournament. Uh, last year, I had girlfriend, but I was busy for travel, for tournament, so I couldn't The whistles her. got woo! So she the was angry, and we broke up. <laughs> that smile at the end there. I love this. Oof, so that was me. That breakup. You should be okay. And I'm I like get. I take credit for Koreans. that one. Listen, hey, wedding, thanks, seven. And Korean culture I was listening. Yeah, I mean, what's the relationship mm. when you have Tekken, right? Yeah, I know you've, you've been well, mentioned earlier. Thank was you. you that said you, you uh, DJ uh, Bustinut, MKL, no, DJ Bustinut, Seven, Don't Cry. Are you kidding me? If he has a chance with a girl, he's taking it. Nothing can stop him. An easy bear day. One of you guys blowed off for video games. I actually just remembered that I actually did blow off my college graduation. Okay, that's that's a big deal. Kind of forgot that. It's not that big of a deal. I mean, college graduations are a sham. Go to school, kids. But, um, yeah, I Graduate, mean, just don't go to the graduation. I would much rather play Team Fortress 2 than go to my college graduation, so, love hats. There you have it. Meanwhile, <laughs> I missed, uh, I missed some important things. Also had a girlfriend situation where I was mm. prioritizing games. Also missed my fraternity's initiation in college. Sure. To play video games <laughs> off of Halo Train Thank you. in Dallas. So I've, I've been there before. I feel these players' pain. Gaming, of course... Reign supreme sometimes. That's the reality, especially when you're playing for as much as they're playing. Hey, thanks, for. Mango Sand. Team USA, but also big, big opportunity for prize pool. Quick thoughts from you guys in this matchup. This matchup, obviously, amongst two of the best players in the United States. It's gone back and forth historically, but you know, I think the last time these guys played, I think Anakin ended up winning. Really? Yeah. Wow. Anakin won this matchup before, but Jimmy's got you know he's got the fans behind him. Everybody's always talking about Jimmy. <laughs> <laughs> this guy. I'm starting to like this guy. Everybody's talking about Jimmy. I mean, Anakin has always made adjustments in the past. Look at that. I like this guy now. I changed my mind. All the pride. Beautiful. That's right. Beautiful visual right there for a lot. I'm starting to like him. Mickey Mouse. In South Korea, that should be a mandated, important thing. It's awesome stuff here. Jimmy, Jimmy Tran, we're ready to get this one underway here. Back to you guys on the desk. I'll give it up. <laughs> Simple as that. I mean, I gave it up already. That's the end of that. Yes, Mishima Dojo. Hey, finally we can play, man. We gotta stop relying on each other to entertain each other. Allow myself to introduce myself. Jimmy with an early life. Jimmy's been fucking everyone up. My boy Anakin trying to fight back. Get away from this wall. Oh, oh, counter hit back one this time around, and look at this combo. Uh, no, the hatchet yeah. on the reset. Damn, right he was just out of way, out of the way. Did you see that? The way that whiff? Jimmy was that was like some fucking John Wack. He was just dodging that shit. That was a gun cotta. That was sick. It didn't even look like he sidestepped. It looked like he just turned his head, leaned his head over. Uh huh. Oh. Big damage. That while standing two block. Once again, a lot of people getting caught in the middle of those strings while standing. Back and forth. One round of peace in this first game. Arslan got eliminated. First he went to losers bracket, six owed by Anakin. And then uh Jimmy beat him on stream. Thank you. The Anakin match was off stream, unfortunately. For those of you who claim that never happened. Let me see the evidence. Way more aggressive than he has in the past. Really? I think so. That's definitely my read from playing him uh, personally in tournament. Mm hmm. Nice sidewalk. Oh, those down back two. Not doing a lot of damage, but they're definitely keeping any guy honest. That was he great kept block. right. <laughs> These are the two guys that beat him. These are the two guys that beat Arslan. Now they got to fight each other. He's pretty nice. It's the way tournaments work. Well, watch Anakin bring you know. Back. I'm telling you right now. It's second. It's always going to final round. It's always back and forth, man. It's always the back and forth. Except for when it's a 6 up. I walk once again. And Jimmy. the thing is, he's choosing the direction to go, right? Like, Jack has an option to track either direction, but Jimmy's had the right guesses, the right reads on which way to go west. Oh, big mid right there. 
Wow. Finally, he's gonna get the wall with this. Uh, uh. This might be enough. Not, not enough. Uh oh. Yo, Jimmy, got stuff inbound. A sliver of health. Here it comes. No, sir. No. Final round. Game stuff. Okay. That's the Steve. I like that Steve soundboard. Jimmy's always prepared. Wow, but yeah, that the, the distance on the walls have actually kind of screwed up right on this. What oh. a lucky jackhammer there! Jimmy held the fort for Damn, game one, one is a fucking wow, slobber knocker. Once again. Look how close this is. Man, I want to get success on this bad boy. Really close Anakin to the gets up. Close the stage, oh, oh. Successful low parry, but no, no nothing. And he, oh. Oh, oh my punish. god, not safe. Yeah. Ooh, that is crazy. Oh, it's gonna get even closer than that. That's also gonna put Jimmy in raise the blue stuff. Good block. Now he's got the blue stuff. Good block again. Kill. Man, that's crazy. Rebugs. <laughs> I don't like it anymore. I changed my mind. He had to block that debug. You know, a low parry would have been better from that situation. But he got the block, very necessary. Anakin, you know, he went for it, right? It's this is an left. experiment to see if it's true what they say about air really subs. Not Anakin's style. No, it's definitely not his style. <laughs> he likes to close I hate that. That's not style. funny. He'll come in and he'll take that poke. We saw him close out that first round. <laughs> Thank second you. to the last round with a down 4-1 for a very good reason. Here we go in the game, too. And man, I'll let you know when it's funny quick again. Rematch. Anakin just want to get right back into it. And look at the early half. Hey, thanks. Ball. Expect <laughs> defeat <laughs> and Thank Papalico. Thanks, Sample Combo uh, uh, and Zach yeah. Rogers. Yeah, Mark talked about on paper this being good for Brian. It's because, you know, those loads from Jack can be crushed by the orbital heel. However, mm -hmm. and countering with those standing jabs. And just conditioning them too, right? Damn. Even starting that was a jet upper. And eventually making Thank a jab out of, out of the air on the full hit. Yeah, Two, one. Jimmy has had a lot of input errors here. He had the sidewalk up that time, went for the jet upper on the whip, but instead got just the back two part of it. So he's got to clean it up a little bit. And can first round. Oh. Two, one. Jackhammer block once again. Oh! Wow, the jet upper with the drop. A very Ooh. rare drop from Jimmy. Man, so, he's missing a lot. Jimmy's fucking up. Thank you. Fall apart here. This is gonna be great, Jimmy. Damn, again. Too late. Too that slow. Punish. That's not easy to do, though. I think it was just a pinch. Just a That's slipper. crazy. It's a lot uh, easier said kill. than done. Punishing a down forward two, two with a jet upper. Game two. All right, final round it's on hard. The side of Take this, he'll secure a match. We'll go to one more to see who's gonna go for it. Lose the side that like Anakin is getting low. crazy now. now, he's, now he's Damn, the big chop. The Dude, the Anakin is fucking him up. Mm -hmm. Okay. Perfect to close it out. Dude. You know it. Seven golden letters for Anakin. Ass blasted. Perfect. That was Three crazy. Made, that's one, way to answer one, one. one. Let me see that bathtub. Determine who's gonna be the U.S. rep. And see who goes on in this tournament. Yes. So loser goes home. That's the end of the road for somebody. Of course, this is loser's side. Thanks, Sass Faria. <sighs> We're in top four right now, yeah. by the way. Oh, dude. <laughs> We've got two Korea, two USA. That's our top four. Winner side of the bracket, we got Nee JDCR. Loser side right now, we've got Anakin and Jimmy J. Man, the Thriller in Manila run back right mm. now happening on WSOE. Gotta happen. People don't even know. You're going to see this, and then you're going to have to go check the tapes for the original. But here we go. Final game. Jimmy J. Tran versus Anakin. California versus Atlanta, Georgia. Oh, dude. I like how I said Regional? California. I took the whole state. Right? You know, but I'm not <laughs> taking North Carolina. We're absorbing it. Just implicated yeah. the entire state. <laughs> but just Atlanta, Georgia. Right? <laughs> no. But only Atlanta, Georgia. Oh, All right, guys. Finish his strings, man. It's paid off today. Uh -huh. Bing, bang. Uh -huh. Boom. Oh, that shoulder. Tries to catch him with the mid and taps him Damn. on the legs once again. That's Yeesh. four rounds straight for Anakin. ATL ho? Like he wants to take Looks like it. He has turned things around completely. Just running through Jimmy J. Tran right now. Jimmy needs to find an answer and he needs to find it quick. The funny thing is, is that Jimmy... You know, I guess they both have a really good chance of going all the way. This is crazy. But it, oh my God. He's got rage too. it just seems like Jimmy has a better chance. Whoa. Oh man. Nice fucking block, dude. Not that time. That was a good low. That was a good Anakin is one round away. Loser semifinals. This is two out of three. Wow. He's working on four, five rounds straight right now. Yeah, Jimmy's got to wake up. Jack Hammer's going to counter it. Look oh my damn it! Oh, he yeah. missed the down four two though. That was a too that slow. Oh, You're dead. Up. Big trouble. Jimmy He's in big, do big right trouble. Now. Down two rounds. Oh, He's dead. Damn. Six rounds straight. Anakin. For Anakin. 
to take one it sandwich the after man. another. He's going to be the U.S. rep and he's going to stay in two six inch foot long for dinner. The same meal. Extra meat. ATL, huh? Two's going head to head right Damn. now. And he can look like the best player in the United States, you ask me. Damn, Jimmy I mean, beat Arslan. He's, here, man. Man. he's the highest placing American here at WSOE 7. Nice. Well I mean, done. You get to have a jacket right? that says Hearthstone on it? Sweet. <laughs> the winner gets this sweet Hearthstone jacket that we have left over from the Hearthstone tournament, which is where we gave away these $50,000 checks. I hope it fits. And now we're finally getting some people. We're starting to get a few seeds from the American representation side. Okay, I'll take it. Looks comfortable. But we have with the champion i'm going to send it over to fallout out on the floor what do you have for us sir thank you so much steve and of course got lauren here to crown this man the official representative he's even taking the hat off here of <laughs> team you. usa he in seoul he didn't win korea, did he south korea he's course, just the highest placing american second. how does it feel so he gets to go I to mean, korea right now, i can just feel my heart about to pump out my chest these interviews after like matches are just like the most raw you know what i mean i still feel like i got the wobbly legs and that's what I'm feeling right now, to be honest, like the real, real answer. But as far as the IESF and everything goes, like I said, this is the first time that United States is going to be repping on the nice global games. scale. And that event reminds me of like the Olympics a bit. And I watched sports growing up and everything like that. So it's kind of like a dream of mine. Yeah, he's you know, an athlete. Know, he's a Red Bull athlete. It's a great feeling to be here, but the job is not done. I want to win this tournament. When I talk to him, like, you know, every time I talk to him in IRL, I ask him, what, what's it like being a Red Bull athlete? And he's like, dude, they send me, like, scuba diving with, like, real athletes. And we go, like, skydiving. And we do all these crazy things together. Like, flying a fucking airplanes. And for real, Red Bull, I guess... I think what Red Bull does is like, all right, you're a Red Bull athlete, and so is this other guy. You guys got to go skydiving now. Hurry up. Go over there and do that shit. And then they, like, videotape it. I don't know. But he has to do all kinds of stuff. Deep sea fishing. So, uh, you know, that day we'll you think I'm making that jokes, that too. You think I'm making jokes. This guy has really done some shit like that. Like, he drove a drag car and, like, uh, went rock climbing with Shaquille O'Neal. I don't know. Some of that stuff is made up, but it's like that kind of thing. Ahead of him to try and come out on top in this. Going into Evo. He's rolling. He's not going to stop. We'll be right back. It seems like the... The overall presentation is great. In fact, it seems like they got better and better. Maybe at first they had like, they hadn't established a rapport with each other. Did you guys watch Soul Calibur earlier? I felt like Soul Calibur was unlistenable. I was like, I was like, couldn't believe it. It was unlistenable. It was so awful. In terms of the overall things that, the way it was being handled, the things that were being said, there's stuff in the air. Reefer smoke? <laughs> Someone's spraying them with a fire extinguisher. Alright. I like that. You'll see exactly movie magic. That's called movie magic. Blast him. Clean, sweet, Asbestos? Who gives a fuck? It's esports. First round matchup went, but man, he's looking strong. Meanwhile, in the losers bracket, we got Anakin in the losers Thanks, Perfect bracket, Legend. What up, dude? Himself a top three spot. He'll play the loser of this one. Thanks, man. He wants both mm, of them. Thanks, he's Star. Yet, Whatever. We have ourselves a great finish to this tournament. Fallout here joined once again with the most handsome two individuals currently on his desk. Right now. <laughs> <laughs> hey, thanks for the silent generosity, Sinister Rain. My man, Mark Man, to my right, of course. Appreciate you've it. You've seen these guys play. You've casted their game play many times before. Yeah. What's different about this matchup in your eyes? Well, the way it's going on, I mean, we always call this, I mentioned it before, the Battle of the Gods, that these guys have been going back and forth over the years, over different Tekken games. And, you know, it always comes out to who's get, who's uh, on top. And right now, knees on top. Knee has knees on top. JDCR is a power bottom, though. When we started off the year, Don't ever so count him out. The first one when they played each other at Evo Japan. But now, you know, things have changed around, and Knee is the guy to beat. So 
I don't know. You can never on count them out. I gotta ask you that, Slacks. Do you believe in those mind games? Do you think that's when someone has someone's number, that's it? You're locked, you're loaded, or do you think it really doesn't matter? Typically, I would say no. But this is the fighting game community, so 100% yes. Mind games are a big deal. And you know what? JDCR used to be on the top. People said that they figured him out. And he knows that they know what he knows, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> Damn. Time to switch it up. He's got mm. a lot of practice. I, think that <laughs> I like this guy. And let's be real with ourselves. <laughs> I know we've been hyping this uh, At first, it That's took a while for him to grow on. <laughs> but I like him. These now. are the South Koreans. <laughs> They're going to absolutely destroy. That was some inception type ish right there. I'm Nothing telling but you. Man. Next level analysis. Uh, I mean, I got a root for the underdog, right? Just about JDCR. Right they did do a blind picks. They don't know yeah, so actually, that's picks. what excites me the most. Yeah. You mentioned blind picks. So, again, which characters are we going to see? In the past, Ni nee will always pick Geese Howard in this matchup against Armor King. So, let's see. Let us see. Well, there you have it. Winner's bracket final. It's a best of five. Thanks, so Paulo. Here, will JDCR continue his streak and punch himself a ticket to the grand finals, or will Ni, nee, the go This is of winners Tekken, finals, right? MJ of Tekken, continue his hey, run. is winners finals out. three out of five? <laughs> the action. We got the best oh, in the business. It is three out of five. Tasty Steve, and it's Rip himself. Damn, Gentlemen, three out of five. Get the Winners fire extinguishers final. out. Here we Infinite go. stage. With Thanks, Roth Hound. Up against me with the <coughs> oh, man. You heard Mark Man call it out before we even got there. Before we even saw what was happening. We know Nika can this play black it. characters. Mm -hmm. And you might have had a Korean champions. Game. Mark called it. We got the geese. block yeah, already. He recently played a combo breaker with the same matchup, and he took it there. And it was pretty convincing, too. Nice 4 1 cancel. Into Ooh. Yeah, this was also the matchup where I decided, you know, I don't like Ooh. JDCR with Armor King. Oh, that's definitely true. You've been one of those advocates hey. talking about... Wow, what a late and, and good break. Like, mm -hmm. That was that fucked up. The throw looked like it was already going. Currently, uh, I think, you know, I that was fucking that crazy. Week, and he said the same thing. And he, th he thinks that Hiachi is his best character, but Armor King's character he likes the most. So he's playing what he likes, you know? Counter hit, down four. Nice, gets the conversion. Pretty hey. nice carry, too. Oh, almost had to tackle him. Oh, wave, wave. Oh, okay. I like it. I like it though. Down back beat. You know, those are moves that he hasn't typically used a lot with Armor King. Mm -hmm. So risk. Like now he's getting used to adding him to his repertoire. Oh, oh! that was sick, oh, dude. That was so sick. The fucking manual low parry, crouch cancel. That was too sick. Did you see that? That was sit up. That he's telling everyone to sit up. Sit up, bitch. Watch this. That was so sick. Because you gotta, it's so telegraphed. That rage drive is telegraphed. So you gotta get creative on how to make them fall for it. And I, you don't get more creative than that. That was awesome. Nice low parry. Damn. All right. Uh -huh. I'm watching. Oh, Giants win. Good tech. Okay, checks him with the down three. I love those normals. Geese has a pretty interesting jab, too, man. It's, it has a <laughs> nice amount of range. Thank man. you. Oh, cool, man. Too. Mm -hmm. Doesn't get it knocked down, but just resetting that neutral is something that he's really good at anyway. Two bars for Geese, down but four, no rage. Down four to his will. Look at now this he's got it. Look at the time. CR. Yeah, but he's behind. Oh, no, he's ahead. Sorry, my bad. Five seconds to go. Oh boy! Oh! Oh, oh my God! Out. Nice too. Sometimes you don't gotta go into attack to close out the round, even have low health. All right. Just wait. You have time on your side. And of course, this is winners finals. Three out of five is the name of the game. Hey, nice. Oh, the big boy. Uh, uh, one pop. Oh God. Oh, nice. Wavel, Wavel tries to hit him with the wild standing four. Once again, JDCR just holding his ground so well. He's not overcommitting. You see a lot of people being <laughs> opened up a lot by geese because they overcommit. Get hit with a 4-1 plus 2. God, they're dumb. That's a great point. Okay. Oof. They got to get that Mickey Mouse guy and Fallout to do commentary. I'd rather hear them. Hey, let's get Mickey Mouse and Fallout on here. And he's got a tiny life lead. He thinks it's enough to hold on to, but this is not going to be enough, right? Time's going to wind down. They don't seem like the go. singing and type. Three bars to work with. I might as well spend some. I mean, you got, oh, you got that could have been it. In the back mode, three. Yes. Oh, oh what? He actually he's he's got to chill. He's got to chill. He's got the life lead now, right? Look at the time. The oh! Oh! 
No, no, oh! No, man, no, he had him. He no. blocked the low, and then he crouch canceled into the fucking. A lot of times these guys get used to taking the space, right? They get used to just going forward instead of just taking that punch. <laughs> Came back to hurt him this time around. Yeah, two bars. And if we were on oh. a wall, wow, gets the counter here. If we were on a wall stage, both of these, both of those meters could be used to close out rounds. This seems pretty hard to do. <laughs> Not to mention it's knee. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, he's really feeling it out. I, I think maybe JCR's arm king has caught him a little bit off guard. Mm -hmm. the, one of the things I did not like about his arm king, the reason I, I felt like it wasn't a good character for him, you know, the character requires you to be a little bit more unsafe. You know, things like yeah. down back three, Excuse where you counter launch it, but launch punches will block. Oh, nah. Wow. Back three to stop the full crouch down. He's dead. Two. Oh, yeah, he's gonna die. No! Oh. Oh, Ten seconds go. He wanted oh, to save the meter. The There's not enough time. Yeah, this is too hard. Not this enough time. Uh, oh, yeah. Nah, nah, I like it, though, right? He went for it. Like, that's, uh, thanks, that's chat. Fun. Ryan Talon, what up, dude? So, thanks, man. Hopefully, here. I'll final see you at Eva. Down thanks, Necrotix and Chaos. Thanks, everybody. Happy big Saturday. Finally getting the block and the punish. What does JDCR stand for? It stands for no questions, bitch. Ooh, too far. Anyway, I hope you're doing well. Down four two tries to catch the side step there. Deactivate again. Man, JCR with those little mini side steps in there. The hope for the high there didn't get it. And it was maximal counter it down for it. Damn. Deep, running it three straight rounds back, but it's not gonna be enough damage to kill here. But he's got such a lead. Yeah. Like, how are you gonna bring this back? Are you gonna make this oh, wow, that oh, oh, crazy. Oh, the no. down three. Oh my gosh. I whiffed in real like I, I legit tried hey, to Hey, what's the deal with that I bug shit going on at uh when, at when Evo, I heard that there's there some kind of oh, the bug going on over but there. He, man, he is, is that so shit a? Uh, is that shit made up? Thank you. Doesn't mean anything to this guy. I've seen Maybe they're gonna get rid of them by the time Evo comes around. I saw him play casual match there's the bugs <laughs> everywhere. Where he was making his only defense was on his mind. I feel like if you yeah, I saw play, some videos on Twitter. That's the extra that lets you know. But they'll just get rid of him by the JDCR time we get there. He talked about his kind, right? His kind of character crisis, right? Mm -hmm. He really likes Armor King. He's going to keep playing it, but obviously you can see some of yeah. the shortcomings, right? Yeah, I don't think it's a character crisis really, right? I think his Armor King is getting stronger and stronger mm -hmm. from what I'm watching. You know, he's has the art. He has the Hiachi back there, right? It's it's his classic. He still has it if he needs to, if he wants to bring it out. He has it there, but I think it's very clear that he wants to use Armor King. I mean, they're not even dangerous. Who cares? Especially really far in this exhibition right here. I'll just stay inside. What if they get inside? Another endless stage. Who does this help in your opinion? Who said that? Hey, thanks, Major Zero, and thanks, Cthulhu Saves. If he gets you to the wall with the combo, the amount of damage he can output on you is absolutely ridiculous with meter, right? He can make literally 80 to 90 combos, and you don't want to risk that. Like Armor King is good with the wall too, for giant swing throws or something, but. I mean, it's just not enough, but that was a crazy arm count. He just did a punch reversal against Geese. That's crazy. I mean, Geese does have a lot of punches that you can reverse. You just have to be ready for it. Okay, they're down two. Nice right. sidewalk. Life in favor of Geese right now. No Damn, Tijuana oh. Titty Twister. Nice. Almost 30 seconds left on the clock. Now, no meter on the side of Geese right now, but he's getting close, though. Side step four is blocked. There it is. Good patience, but if he's looking at me, he's he's got the rage. He's just like, all right, that's fine. I get to poke you more, and it's gonna do more damage. What? Oh, oh the down that was one stop the shoulder. Oh, the dude, that was, was far. There. That looked really and far away. That that's first round. that was and the poke between these really guys is far. Ridiculous. That move is cheap. Oh, and very importantly, you gotta watch down the spacing, right? They, they're both trying to use space Jesus, here. Yeah. Good. Thank the right you. Time. I just maximize they buff them. the distance between each other just so they, they, you know exactly what move your opponent's going for. You're trying to just barely outspace it so yeah. you can totally make them pay for it. And you can tell both of these guys willing to take their time. Oh, side step three. Hey, look at this. He finally getting full control, especially after that first game. It looked like JDC <laughs> was in control. <laughs> Thank these you. Later rounds. Oh, hey, so thanks, 109 right and Big Red Surfer. No, crazy good block. Thanks for liking my stream, it. everybody. pressure on there, right? Because eventually, Jason might want to try to duck the throw, and then that back 3-2 is coming from Geese. Mm -hmm. Look at the jab. Man, this such a cheap working. fucking dude, character. This is crazy. These jabs are bullshit, be around, dude. Man, He's got the best jab in the game, so in case you don't know. That entire round. 
Him and Akuma, I think they both have similar jabs in that they recover faster than regular jabs. And that's the thing, right? Armor King has this option stack where you can do that crowd dash. It's a good jab. the multi button input is, but you get a kind of like an auto randomized throw attack. Basically, you gotta, you get like one plus four or two plus three, right? Yeah, and so I think it's either Giant's Ring Did or the Did you just say R2 oh, yeah, plus 3? Right, yeah. yeah. So you, and like, so you, as an opponent, you don't know which one's coming. Yeah, you, and you or 2 plus 3. Especially if you Maybe know that's what he said. While standing four, 4, it's definitely going to open somebody up eventually. But here we go. Knee still, man. He is... Sometimes you got to really think about it. Set. You know, two bars to work with here. That's where Geese is extra dangerous. And he's got over half life bar lead to close out game 2. Oh, there's the back man. kick almost hit confirms. I feel like he does. Everyone tells me you can't hit confirm, but man, when you see something like that, like you really think he, he didn't confirm that? You think he just threw that out there? Man, that's Especially tough. Especially get somebody like JDCR. We're getting a switch. And the music kicks in. <laughs> oh yeah, he's he's strutting. It's strutting time, back boys. to character select. We're going to the character he's select. The button or can be changed. Get up in there. Yeah, we gotta get that Let's Mickey Mouse get, guy and that other guy to do the commentary here. Do you think he's gonna uh, stick it out? Fall out, Mickey Mouse. Game? Let's get them in here. These commentators are out of control. Look at the route countdown. Get rid of them. That second game definitely looking a lot worse. I'm doing great. Way worse, but he's hovering over that armor king still. I hope you're doing great too. Thanks, the judge, for liking my stream and donating. Perhaps I should. Silently. It's very nice of course, and they are. This is the first of three wins on the winner's side. Oh, hey, I heard of a new game. I'm going to play it on Monday. It's called Bloody something. It's like a bootleg Sekiro. Locked in. Finally going to commit. Have you heard of it? Last answer and commitment for JDCR. Not Bloody Roar. And he can't pick the stage. Well, I guess it's where I'm at. Bloody Spell. see what they're going to do. It's called Bloody Spell. The stage of the Forgotten Realm. He's going to Armor King Town. Now, this is actually it's trash? Yeah, I'm hoping it sucks. King. That way we can Arcane have a nice spite stream on Monday. The input and the execution to yeah. do those, you know, magic four instant shining with the combos for floor break maximized damage. Bloody you stool. need to be careful. Yeah, that's it. CR. But we've already seen me be more than comfortable, you know, reversing matches, stealing rounds again. And that game has Cooch and Teets. Yeah, I saw it. You can make your character completely <laughs> naked and run around with her anime tits flopping. Oh, okay. I'm sure you guys will love it. Go. Thanks, Roman T and Raz Grizz R. Here. Thanks very much. That loser side. Anakin is waiting. There's a break on the multi throw. Oh, wow! Magic Four doesn't get the combo. That's what I was talking about before. He was definitely trying to go for some big boy damage. Gets the multi throw. Stretch muffler. No. Tomorrow I'm busy. I'm gonna go to the movies. Hey, hey, hey. Uh, I'm gonna go see that movie uh, Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. I haven't been to the movies. Maybe in four years. Of this third game looking a lot better. Side step four. You talked about him opening up. Hey, when did that movie come out that I saw? Uh, Star. No, Star Wars, the one with Harrison Ford. Uh, but not the old ones. The new ones with Harrison Ford. And he's going with the different breaks as well. Four, one plus two. Star Wars Endgame. Going downstairs, he is. Okay. Three years ago, 2015. Yeah, that's when I went to the movies. I saw that one. You gave me a wall. You gave me a wall. I think I'm gonna get ices and popcorn. The white letters, I figure, why not? Might as well get the full-blown theater experience. That's gonna be a floor break. I think that's such a cool combo. Yes. Ooh, I like that. Oh, I love that new trick. Good chunk of damage already. Tries to go for the spear. Ouch. Good running one attempt from me here. And he's got another bar to work with. East with meters where he's going to get 3 0'd by Geese. Ran back the damage to JDCR. Great. Right. I mean, that's why so many people think that we're guaranteed to see a Geese Howard in the top eight of Evo this year, too. Smuggle yeah, in your own icy. Well, there are two problems with that idea. The first problem is I'm not a piece of shit. But the second problem is uh, my fucking icy machine is out of order. What do you mean, my own icy? How the fuck am I gonna do that? Oh no, floor break and the walls right there not even needed. Oh, gets to save the floor for next round potentially. JDCR two rounds to one now. He's gonna need to run it back another match though if he really wants to stand a chance. Nice break on the tombstone. Important break. Yeah, we saw that uh, that giant swing finally hit his mark. We saw the one plus two throw finally hit his mark. Maybe we're seeing some defensive errors on the side of knee. 
I mean, no matter how good you are, throw text and tech and I wonder if they're gonna have time throw crisis. Game, throw game from the character. And no, oh. he's gonna break him up. Beautiful duck in the eye. Hopkins for the punish. Going downstairs. Here we go. Basement time, boys. Ooh. Hey, oh. hey, hey. Oh, big damage. Recover's crouching right there. Down two. Knee trying to fight himself away from this corner, though. He's using jabs. Mm -hmm. Get off of me. He's got two bars. Might be time to use a jab. Nah, yeah, hell no. That, that must have been a mistake. He's not gonna There's no the way that he did that on purpose. Oh my god, Why I take it back. I take it back. I was wrong. Wait, he's going for the combo. That was a mistake. You gave me a wall? Uh, uh -huh. Look at this life you just had. Oh. You had the lead. He gave me a wall? Oh, the oh shit. Time, time. He has to spend the rage art. Oh, Is wow. it going to kill him? It might. He's going to have three seconds to run up and go for a 50 50 here. This is about to get crazy. Last no. chance. What's gonna happen? Oh, nice. Oh, oh, oh my god, <laughs> dude. He could have punished that, right? Yo, that was crazy. I think that, that get up kick, the mid on. version He's from that position board. is minus 14, Two games isn't it? To one now. Uh -oh. Unless I remember it wrong. Mm -hmm. If it was He's face up, feet towards, it's minus 12. Machine. Yeah, yeah minus 14. He could have oh, shouldered. Man. He could have yeah. shouldered. <laughs> Damn, he could have killed him, but instead he did down choice. forward four, which doesn't reach. He won anyway, but still, that was rough. He could shoulder. He could shoulder that one. Oh, he could have shouldered that right? Wasn't he? That's what they're talking about right now. I think he could have shouldered that too. From what I remember, it was the mid version of the face down feet towards kick. I don't know if it was face towards or face away. Uh, thanks, Spec. Whatever. And thanks, Fluffy Yuki and Raz Grizz. Thanks. He's his bitch. Thank you. He's pretty good. Mm -hmm. And back to infinite stage, by the way. Mm, thanks, mm -hmm. Chatty, for the subscription. Damn, JDCR still in this. The, um, Man, the he had to work so hard for one win. Definitely good on the floor break stage. I mean, Geese isn't it's bad doable. And look, Titty is Twister. Finally starting to get opening him up with some of these throws. Oh, he going for the side combo that time. Down two. Again, man. I don't know how he's placing these down threes, but they always seem to work. Which one are we going for? Thanks, Raconica. Appreciate it, man. They play a really up close, dangerous game. Yeah, that was sick. Uh oh. One, one, two. The punish. Ching. Rage on the side of Geese. Yo, JDCR right now. Rage on the Excuse side me. of knee, and it does not matter. JDCR. I like what I'm seeing, I like what I'm seeing right now. He's mixing it up, right? Like that, that last Thank round, you. that was classic. Yeah, he's JDCR. working hard, but, ones. you know, he's you know, good. Like, that was not how he's been playing arm kick throughout this entire I'm rooting for JDCR. I want to believe. Using different attacks, just slowing down his office. He has a death sandwich, yeah. You guys believe? Like, when was the last time we saw him hit that with arm kick? And I know he's trying to get me to run into something. Oh, right I, I hexed him? Alright, so let's important. start talking yeah. about how unbeatable knee is. Boy, knee is oh, unbeatable. Larry, four, four on the follow -up. Don't you agree? Man, Don't four, step. Three? He knew it's too late. Him. What about if I hex you? you? Is it yeah, too late for that? You gotta choose the correct moves to track each direction, right? Only one way to find so out. He's doing here. But still, regardless, knee. Good life lead with 15 seconds to go on the clock. Oh, what a block. Still a little slow, but still getting the punish after that. 10 seconds. Dude, look at this clock. Eight, eight seconds up feels clock. bad, man. Oh, feels oh, good, man? Feels jab, bad, man. So smart. Thanks, Torres. Okay, JDCR, once again, he needs, the, he needs these next Is two rounds. Is this still a good to time to get Tekken? Got one more round uh, more I mean, it's pretty fucking six. cheap. What else are you going to get? Street Fighter Five? Come on, man. Bars to go, though. I mean, yeah, I guess. Unless you don't want to. He has two bars. You know he's just fishing for. Anyway, yeah. He knows any conversion is going to be good at this point. Thank you. Even though there's no walls, there's still going to be momentum on his side. Oh, tries to go for the damn three. He's like, no, not this time. Gets him with the counter hit back one. That's a little tricky. drops sometimes. It's just a little tricky to do anyway, because sometimes you have to side step and then step forward just to get the... Get Killer Instinct. Yeah, you could get Killer Bitch Stink, but first you're going to have to figure out how to get people to not think you're annoying as fuck. Really uh, so that's really the biggest struggle <laughs> when it comes to being a Killer Instinct fan. Nice, blo nice block and punish right there. That's a sidestep. The black jab, one of the quicker you know what I mean? moves by Armor King. Six seconds left. <clears throat> oh man, who has life lead? I think Nee does right now. Yeah. Two seconds. Dude. He's got meter. I was just raging storm. Yeah. Brutal. Okay. There you go. Nee keeps the life lead. Damn, these are like agonizing defeats. JDCR is definitely in trouble right now. Tries to go forward to punish on the whip throw. Completely. Agonizing. Beautiful defense. 
And punch from Neat. JD Star stuffed him out of the air, but didn't get confirmed. And back to shoots best the bar right when he finally lands it. Yeah, his back one is not like King, so it does have a little flow to it. They Look at that two bar combo. Anything. Look at the damage on it. He spent all his meter on this round. He's trying to close it out here. Nah. He's trying to get to that grand final. Oh. JD Star has oh. race. Nothing nah. in the matter. Knee gonna be advancing to the grand finals. Staying Man, on the other side. Man, the only guy oh, that could beat Knee was Arslan. And he lost to right two US players. But that's Damn. Up Got up in there. Who's gonna stop me? Oh, man, revolution. Going Should they try a TR2 eventually? Again. But we're not ready to What's go that? there just yet. Oh, man, no. Not hey, yet. thanks, man, Mad Wolf. Oh, match. shit. I'm a big yet. fan, Mad Wolf. I wonder if that's the real one. Out of the boys. Um, what did he What's say? What's gonna happen next? I like that name. Fallout of the Fallout Boys. I wonder if it is. Yeah, Probably like not. It's not the Fallout Boys. Uh, Fallout Tekken Fallout Revolution boys. 2? Yeah. Like nah. Yeah, uh, see, thanks, Nielsen. And uh, Aquios. Like and thanks, Mad Wolf. Uh, nah. I think I like Tekken 7 a lot. If I could have it my way, I would want Tekken 7 to get more seasons. At least one more. I don't know. That would be really cool. My, That's my opinion. And I want them to bring back old characters with one, like, guest. The same trend of Season 2. So, like, a big handful of old characters, whoever, Wang, Beck, whatever. And then one guest, like, like some other character from some dying franchise, like uh, Walking Dead or uh, Final Fantasy, you know, or KOF. You know what I mean? Just just find some bargain bin character and get that shit on the cheap, and then, you know, boom, you're in the money. Last? That's right. Who was that? I don't know. That was, was me. That me. Was that you? Hello. That was me. Well, you know, you guys should be happy. I mean, Why at least that? I'm the newcomer. At least I was wrong. It would be very embarrassing for you people if you were wrong. I mean, you people. What are you gonna do? What does he oh, mean by you people? Is he talking about Tekken players? Should I do it? In that bath Go for it. Don't talk too soon. Oh, what the hell is this? Don't speak too soon. Give me my bath water. Real men drink bath water. Oh, you. What's oh. good? Oh, Is he gonna yeah. drink that oh, shit? Oh, that looks like it has chemicals Not in it. Game. Chemicals and hair follicles. Yeah. Mine. I believe you said it was your DNA before. It is my DNA. You're about to... Listen, you people have you not met me DNA. before. I've done some nasty stuff. Stuff. <laughs> Man, Mickey Mouse. What do you mean? What, what's up? I've done some nasty stuff. I'm just gonna enjoy this real quick. Hell yeah! I'm gonna kick my feet up. Is this my camera? I actually don't wanna watch I'm gonna kick my feet up and enjoy where, where this real quick. Oh, no problem, oh, yeah. man. I drink this kind of nasty <laughs> stuff all the time. You. From Dota, they always put weird shit in my mouth. Savage. No problem. <laughs> hey, he said that. Oh, oh my god! Uh, Did you have to do it like what is going on? What is going on, on dude? What is going on? Woo! Yeah, I had to do it like that. I don't that. give a shit. Oh my goodness. Give me some more. I'm thirsty, baby. What is okay, going I, I on? I take it down. I take it down. What's wrong with you, man? That's the Dollar Shave Club water. Literally, I the Dollar Shave, shave Club. I shaved naked in that bathtub. Who cares, man? I've been in juvie. Care. You gotta know how to, you know, get stuff down your mouth if you want to make it out of there. <laughs> I'm fun. It's all good, baby. Oh, <laughs> all day. Thank you. Oh, all day. You know, I make a lot of jokes about how I'm like, you know, I'm 34 years old and I still laugh at jokes like, you know, someone will donate as Suquan Madik or some shit and I'll laugh at that for 30 minutes. But I got to say, I'm feeling like adult as AF right now. Modest at best of this guy saying something crazy. D is that I'm is feeling that the like an adult of crazy from this guy right now? Maybe casters, I gotta ask you guys, Steve, you're watching this from afar. What are your thoughts on this? I've oh, never shit. felt more That's mature in my entire life. <laughs> what? <laughs> What do you think he had down his mouth? I don't know. I mean, he said they made him put some weird shit in there. I want to know. I need to see this. This is. I don't want to see this. Actually, I don't know. That's I my think thing. I, I want to okay. see. That's right. That guy <laughs> was in that water <laughs> earlier. I hope so. Oh God, just <laughs> thinking about it. I mean, it has a bluish <laughs> chemical <laughs> hue to it, <laughs> and the dude fucking shaved <laughs> in that water. I feel a little lightheaded. I don't know what's going on. That's fucked up. That's, 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 that's like some jackass shit. I wonder if this guy will eat some horse shit if I give him money. I'm down. Hey, we could do a fucking GoFundMe and feed this guy some horse shit on the next one. You know? You know what I mean? I'll get in. I'll go in on that. I'm sure you guys would kick down a couple bucks. 
It's good for the immune system. That was crazy. <laughs> oh my oh, god, why would you oh, show that again? That's like watching the people look, look, break their limbs. Look at Mark Man's face. Oh god. That's... Why would you show that again? Butt hat. Jack Miller. I was very nuts. Hey, thanks, Brutalizer, and Jaeger, and Rogue Athena. <laughs> and Lord Brady, <laughs> thanks. Uh, Gold 16 <laughs> and Sagan D Sniper 69. Uh, Epic well, failure and everybody else. Game, thanks. We had listen, <laughs> rather than taking breaks, commercial break. Hey, listen, how many broadcasts? I want to ask you, do? Steve. Huh? Steve and Rip, how huh? many broadcasts have you been part of? Where well, rather than being like, we'll be right back with a three minute break, we have the, the <laughs> analysts drink bath water. I mean, this is the first for me. I don't know about you. Yeah, this is the first for a lot of people, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure. They are here drinking bath water. You know, water. it's funny yeah, because I earlier I was yeah, trying to give constructive yeah. criticism yeah, on how they could improve. And I almost feel like they really turned it up all the way just to tell me to shut the fuck up. Oh, this is how we should improve? Watch this. Earlier I was like, you know, it would be better if maybe. You know, I'm trying to be constructive, and now they they're like, oh, oh, you think that we should have more Tekken players? So it sounds like they know what they're talking about. Uh, we got to change to the script. Get Mickey Mouse to drink that other dude's bath water. And then show the fucking instant replay in super slow mo. Teach this fat guy with a beard to talk shit about our presentation. And now Anakin with a slight light beam looks like oh, that really took me out of the mood, right? <laughs> the last thing I give a fuck about is even looking at this right now, to be honest. Uh Jar Brew and Mad Villain, Full Steel, Epic Failure, and Rogue Athena. I kinda wanna go for a walk. I'll be honest, I I'd go for a walk. I don't really want to watch this. Anymore. <laughs> yeah, you gotta wonder where JD Star's confidence levels are at, right? He just came that off was that loss. Mm -hmm. It's probably feeling what pretty the good for that playing. Okay, but that's part of being like one of the best in the world, right? You gotta be ready for stuff like that. Alright, no big deal. Bounce back at all times. Without a doubt. Oh. Ball saying 2 1 and the shorter. And get off to a quick lead here. Three. Already third round. Man. Anakin is looking super sharp. Maybe this is what we're supposed to expect of him. But how long does it last? Here's a hop kick. That was sexy, man. JD Star uh, with the uh. hop kick in the middle of the string. Like he's like, dude. Damn, dude. dude. To Anakin already like lost to JD, JD, right? This is a, isn't this a double Jeopardy match? Coming from Anakin. That looked like it was max range. Mm, that was exactly exactly yeah, what I thought. Pretty low sure. I'm surprised he even blocked <laughs> exactly. it. He's doing low prairie, though. Excuse me. Okay. Uh huh. Ooh, big boy combo. I love it. Love it. Damn, dude, why the hell would you drink that water? He probably spit it out. Did he spit it out? I stopped looking. I stopped looking when he was, like, doing the down the hatch gesture. No, yes. thinking that he was gonna dash in a couple. Man, that was fucked up. Down four, two. Twice in a row, there, right? Twice in a row. That guy's that shaving guy's trimmings were in that water. The jab on him. Mm -hmm. Using that movement. Nice, the two-one. Hop kick. Uh, lots of hop kicks Back right now, right? Wall, Man, that shit's got my kick. face all one crooked. On one. Uh. I can't straighten out my face okay. now. Uh, <laughs> shit's got. Okay. Okay. Round number <laughs> can't four. straighten it out. out. JDCR is like, okay. I understand. Here he is in rage, though. Bent, bent out of shape. Backing up. Those twos. Got to be careful. Those hop kicks have been pretty successful. How am I supposed it's to watch down like down this? One. Oh. oh man, yeah. That Damn, Anakin. Kind of a crazy Damn, like JDCR must have seen that water drinking shit. He's, like an online player He's right thrown now. off too. All the players are, <laughs> all the players are a little disgusted, thrown up in their mouth. Uh, thanks, Besiled. Super crisp right now. Thanks very much, Madman Meaty, and everybody else. Hope you guys are enjoying your big Saturday, despite all the disgusting shit we've seen so far. I mean, there were some good matches. What's for dinner? I I have pizza, leftover pizza. So those down four ones are one of your main sources. And, and he's wings. Just removing it completely. He's like, yeah, I know what you need to do, but here's what you're not going to do. Abuse you were having a good day until one. the bathwater? Yeah, this shit ruined right my whole week. Hopefully the, you know, V-bugs flying around Las Vegas, Vegas get back. cleared up before I get there. That would be nice. I don't know what the fuck's going on with that. I pretended like I didn't even see it. What the hell's going on? V-bug infestation. Anakin wins game number one. Here we go. Game number two. Like I said, those down four ones and goes right in the instant shining wizard. Getting buzzed down. Uh, 
And the floor break. Combo incoming. The oh, wow. One. Yeah, Look four at this combo. combo conversion. I don't know if that last back one was going to hit, though. Would have set up some amazing Oki. Oh, the dark up. Oh, oh. But he drops the combo hey, after it. Look he at this. said that. This guy over here and said they like swapped the water out. Thank you. Some it, was a, it wasn't was It was really the bath water. I stopped looking, dude. You think I want to fucking keep looking at that shit and fucking decide whether or not that shit is the real water? It was drinkable bath water. Oh, yeah, all right. Well, that's cool. That's how you know these guys are playing another level right now. Yeah, they, they're familiar with one another. That's that shit's that fucking... Uh, engaged. Oh, punish. Not cool. The whole, the whole thing is, is, is no good. <laughs> Thank you. There it is. Down four ones. They're back in the game now. And look how much slower the pace of the round goes. I don't even want to see that guy drink regular water. Yeah, both these players are still good. I mean, at this level, right? Everyone is still good with movement. Oh, look Thank at Anakin running in his face. I mean, did you see Jason avoid all that? That was like the Matrix. Trinity. <laughs> Help. <laughs> look at the range that they're playing at. And he gets back to the wall now. Thank he's fighting you. out of there. Man, this is crazy. Like, One. he's ducking all the highs. But they're getting hit by all the lows. The <laughs> Man, the most exciting the match players. was Jimmy J. Arsenal. Right and wrong. Was so tight. Right and wrong at the same time. What does Both that mean? Them. And no one's getting hit. <laughs> 23 seconds left on the clock. Anakin Dude, if Anakin wins this, this, that would be sweet Reach because JDC, JDCR oh, already oh, took a crack oh, at knee oh, and he got oh, fucked up. So I'd like to see Anakin try to give it a whirl. Not that I don't want. Damn, V Bucks. Oh, oh, is right. He's got that blue stuff ready too. Down nice. back one to close it out. And he doesn't let him get started. JDR a little too antsy there, right? Didn't that, pull the trigger on anything. And that was looking like the most obvious. Do you hate the Mickey Mouse guy again? No, because choice. I never hated him in the first place. Okay. Uh, and wow. I don't think he that I do wall. now. He definitely got it. But oh, look at oh, that boy. damage. You know. Whatever. Uh, thanks, Five String Killer and Moldunite, Na Nabisco Ninja, King Hunter, and Quan. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Anakin on the verge of going up 2 0 right now over JDC on Yeah, Jimmy's out. He lost to Anakin. Counter hit, confirm the wall. Shoulder. Not dead, not dead. JDC are still in this game. Oh, in this game. You gotta be careful. back to That's wall. John Swing is a threat. Damn, Anakin. Anakin. Oh, oh my god. Jesus. Running down 4-4. Four, four. That is two, crazy. USA. He's been... Dude, he's been training by skydiving and mountain climbing Ooh, man, he is really with other esports I mean, athletes. Oh. Red Bull athletes. Not esports. No, real okay. sports. He said that he hangs out with like une uneven parallel bar gymnasts and like uh, race car drivers and all kinds of other types of smo uh, sports. Smarts. <laughs> you know. You know what I mean. E smarts. But look, you know what I mean? You're, you're following me with Shaq? Yeah. And he said himself that he won both of these Korean players. He plays yeah, with he Shaq. He never beat either of them, but why not today? Remember I talked about that execution? Look at that. <laughs> that was a beginning Thank game you. that worked out to almost 45% life. The back two hits, though. Oh, oh. rocket kick. It's the counter kick for confirm off of the 4-2. Once again, back in, just right back in. Damn. Trying to swing wow. in the middle, gets the counter hit. Man, confirmed. Anakin is kicking the, the shit out of JDCR. I don't know if you noticed. Two, four, two, uh oh, not anymore, he ain't. Man, I really shouldn't say anything, huh? That's pretty weird. I mean, how am I supposed to, uh, you know, put on a stream <laughs> if I can't talk? You know, that doesn't really work. Hey, don't go hexing anyone now you're here. Sorry, man. Too late. I hexed that last round. Look, here's the way it's going to work. I'm just going to be hexing. Simple as that. What you should do is, first of all, understand that no matter what, there's going to be hexing going on. And furthermore, I would say you should hope to stay on my good side so you don't get hexed. Look at his combo. No, I can't.
Oh, no. oh, oh my god. Hey, thanks, Phil Baroni and Furzy. Damn, trying to get that bath water. Thanks for the big donation, man. Thanks, thanks, Bard and uh, Manliest Man Nurse. And thanks, Johnny Haha. Mm, thanks again, Furzy and everybody else. Big Jack. Oh. Anakin's defense in this set has been so good. We're like, what's he risking, really? Uh, not much. No, Think not. about it. This most like <laughs> yeah, folks down four ones, you. two ones. Not a lot of damage. Sometimes those down threes. But look how much work he has to do to try to close out this round. A series of hits from JDCR and Steel Anakin not even in range. Yeesh. One round away from 3 0 right JDCR? He can move on Damn. to the finals versus me. Is he going to sweep USA? JDCR? Is JDCR going to let this happen? Mm -hmm. Is this arm going to really cut out? Oh. That could have been big. Oh. Wow. wow. Was that a oh. I think it was. It looked like it. Oh my god. It's not looking good. JDCR is in big trouble right now. He had the size of no Why did the second hit hit? Oh. oh my god. JDCR token. No, that's going to be a crazy. Anakin, Anakin just 3 0 JDCR. Anakin wow. To the grand finals. Anakin nice game. JDCR. He, he called it. I mean, he called it. He said, I want them both. Look how he's walking around the Why stage. Why not today? Play that Mighty Ducks music Did for you again. see how he put Mighty his hands Ducks in his pocket music. like, you know, just another day at the Is that playground. some racial shit? Another Why day not? at the playground. Back to the jungle gym. One time Damn. down the slide and now I'm Someone get me a line. water. Hurry up. Where's my drinks, man? Where's my drinks? Red Bull. Get me a Red Bull. Green one. Right now. Over at the disc. My man Anakin. This ain't a Red Bull. Damn. This one un... Uh, thanks, Ferrari Pamu. And Oink Perro. Thanks. So that's what I got. That's what I got. Unbelievable. This is crazy. Man. Appreciate it. That's a natural combo in season two? Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Thanks for the reminder. Um, That's 1 1. I forgot about that change. That's a punish now, right? Every WSOE event has had a Cinderella story like that. You talk about season I forgot Halloween, about what that. they did at WSOE 3, their first tournament together. Now they're third place World Cup champs. Natural about combo. I, WSOE 6, 13, and Serenity. And now we're one, talking one. about Anakin working through the loser's bracket like nice. that. Nice. What is happening right now? This is unbelievable. He's on a high streak, man. He's a winner. He's already doing this other thing with the American medal. He's already in the grand finals. It's a real <laughs> Cinderella story. Thank you. But this is not Disney. Okay, he has to go <laughs> up against me. Come on. Is there any hope? You say the clock strikes Take midnight. Take a two-minute break. It's, there's no way. Dude. There's no way. There's I no love way. it. He uh, said no way. I mean, I like to believe in... I mean, this is shaping it up like this. It's USA versus Korea. This is the grand finals. I want America to win. But is he going to be able to do it? I don't know. Mm. Knee is kind of tough. He's... Thanks, he's Prospect he and Six Shaw. And look at the way he did it, too. Again, we were talking You think they're going to be a long there. time? It's not often in Tekken. In Tekken, you told me, yep. that you, you get dominated like that in the winner's back in round one, and you come back and dominate <laughs> in the fashion 3-0 reverse sweep, essentially, and, and does it back to him. That, that the reason his voice is like that is because he drinks too is. much I mean, um, shaving water. Data, I mean, this is a rematch from Combo Breaker that happened earlier this year, and Anakin was actually in the winner's side. Shouldn't have drank, drank so much shaving water. Drink Maybe he would have hit puberty before he started uh, joining the BGC. He beat the snot out of him. Yeah, that'll, that'll happen, I guess. Shaving water. And now here we go. Anakin has a chance to do it back to him. Well, let's see if he's going to be able to. I mean, again, this is going to come down to the characters. Here, here. against a lot of character matchups. I mean, of course, Anakin's sticking with Jack Seven the entire time. Shaving but which water. character is Nee gonna bring out? He brought out Devil Jin last time. He brought out uh, Paul. Damn, dude, Nee's getting high. Hmm. We'll see. Wow. Well, the stage is certainly set, and I gonna need some time to rest my heart a little bit on the analyst desk because it's getting too crazy over there. Meanwhile, we got Lauren <coughs> at the other side of the studio. How you doing with the heat? Uh oh. Well, and I think these players are getting ready to go too. But I want to let you guys know about something. We are giving away a free. PC desktop. All you have to do in that Twitch chat, click on the link, fill out whatever you gotta fill out, and guess what? We're gonna terms be apply. Twitter. Don't forget about those Twitter, terms, bitch. Okay? Twitter. We will tell you who wins two thousand dollars 
NZXT gaming PC. So make sure to get on get in on that. Drinking habit. too much shaving <laughs> water. Okay. There's a lot going on. <laughs> And on top of that, shaving we're water. In your predictions. Who do you think is going to win? Tweet Too much shaving up, water. <laughs> Thank we'll you. That'll do that. Okay? That's all you got to do. Fall out with us. I don't think it works if you type it in my chat, you dumbasses. <laughs> hey, go ahead and type it, bud. You'll be entered to win. Good luck, amigo. Oh, I'm looking back at Eve. Good luck, guys. Boy, era subs. God, they're dumb. Hey, thanks, Elliot Toiler and Prospect. It is me, undoubtedly, yep. right? It's, I, I'm, Gee, I hope I win. Like I said, right now, for Anakin to win this, he has to win six <laughs> matches. Wow. A first set, three matches, and of course, the second set, three matches. Can he do it? I don't know. I don't know. What do you guys think? Right, he could, but we've seen such clutch come out. You're like the Grinch. Already. What? You're like the Grinch. I'm not the Grinch. He picked saying me. this isn't Disney. You're he saying. Picked, remember, he picked me to win the whole thing. No, he didn't. He picked. I almost did. Oh, he picked no, someone you're right. else. You're right. He someone else. Never mind. I, I forgot said Knee was going to win, and Arslan would. You're right. <laughs> if <laughs> uh, Anakin <laughs> wins this, that would be pretty That's impressive. Right. It's true. Tasty, yeah. you're a savage. And he called. He called Sane in the finals. So, the finals so that. hard. Unbelievable. Tasty Steve, you didn't make it. So Super hard. Let's see if your prediction will be right here. How likely? Anakin, the man Extremely unlikely. Swag himself. Can he do He's got to use Korean Jack God. the whole time because he never Jack uses anyone else. Finals of and he could use anything. And Soul Calibur showdown. And he could do action, anything. We got the best to pick any character. Tasty Steve and Rip. Guys, we're back. Like Look at Man said, see? history repeats Paul. itself. Combo Breaker 2019 Grand Finals is what right, you see cool. right here, except for it was reversed. Exactly. Knee coming from the losers, while Anakin sitting on the winner's side. But here we go, Rip. Talk to me. Exactly. This is the reverse. This time, Anakin coming back from the loser's side. His opportunity <coughs> to do what Knee did to him at Combo Breaker. And me going at least the good news is that Anakin feels comfortable in the match. So, you're not going to see any wool being pulled. Hit him with the shoulder. So much damage on the table. Goes for the mid on the follow up. And if you go back to Combo Breaker, man, Anakin was rolling. He took him all the way down. He was like one round away, I feel like, from winning the tournament multiple times. But he just clutched okay, it out Rage repeatedly, yourself. as we've seen him do in this tournament. Nice break. And now, the run back. Oh, oh modified oh, Volcano oh, Buster. Oh, what is happening? Oh, the jab. The knee factor. Oh, get the jab to my man. This the is fuck crazy already. Why? Why is this the first round? Why is this the first round? Against. Oh, my God. Are you serious? V Bucks? One. One. Hey. Yo, yo. Just one of them. Yeah, you thought I was going to freeze that thing unless you launch me? I don't think so. Damn. I know you're good. He's not scared. That's what you have to do. Don't be scared. That's what these Korean guys want. They want their reputation to win the fight before it even starts. I'm Korean. Don't forget I'm Korean, bitch. That's what they want. And that's how they win a lot of the time. You can't be scared. Oh man, he's stuck up against his wall right now. Works his way away. He gives his pace, but that's what. And another drop combo. Is Anakin gonna clutch out another volcano buster? No, there's no way he's gonna fall back to do that again. There's no oh, way. Oh god. Oh, the one put you get off him. Oh. Did he? Oh! How does he know these things? Get out of the way! Oh my god. <laughs> what the fuck am I watching? This is a this is a circus. The amo de serio. The stage of history. How is Anakin winning this? He's already won two games by now if he didn't fuck up his combos. We could have been on game three already. Oh, wait a second, wait a second. God. Look at this damage. Hell of damage. Rage mode for Paul. Oh, my. 3 0? Say words. And look at him. Confidence on that man's face. He's like, this is what should have happened at Combo Breaker. He said he thought it was over. You thought we weren't going to cross paths again. You're wrong, Mr. Knee. You're wrong. Here we are. Oh, yeah. boy. Shut up, Steve. Excuse me. Uh, thanks, Kupo Carnage. On the stage of history. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> That's pretty good. Dang, and you spent that paper out of control, too. Hey, I see you ripped thanks. down 4-2. Exactly how that first round last game started for Anakin. Uh, uh, uh. No, Try sir. To... All right, that's an outstanding three. Oh, man. man. Woke up with this. Mm -hmm. It's out of range, yeah. You know, Neil was exactly needing an adjustment. Give it to Phoenix. That was a beautiful duck. Baited out the forward two. Got the hockey for the punish. <laughs> Dashes up. Get <laughs> the devil man for the ender. And now he's got rage. And look at his life is all caught up. And Anakin, unfortunately, doesn't even land in his rage. He's just yeah. running up to knee. 
Yeah, he's just running up to him and just closing yeah, that's what you gotta do. Don't be. But no break on that throw. Mix up. Don't look. That's this is what changed about Attic in the past year, year and a half, right? Don't be scared. Way more aggressive. Uh, thanks, Edgardo. He just can fall back onto the defense whenever he wants. Thanks very much. He also has that aggressive style if he wants to tap into that now. Oh, the mob kick cutting through everything. Looking at a different need this oh, time. Oh, ouch! Damage. <laughs> oh. Thank you. Uh oh. Okay. Me. Really close, oh, sir. Hmm. Oh yeah, and look, just as I said, that that adjustment, that first game, me was like, yo, nice. man, hold up. Uh, like fat Geek homeless Howard. chaos. I've been these other characters. Thanks. And bald Gaylord. Ball Thanks Don't very much, guys. Though, I remember. That's why I picked for the ball, subs. Right? No worries. Thanks for using your Twitch oh, Prime on my stream. This time, but didn't believe in it. Small whip punish, nothing big though. But boy, he is busting him up this game. Mm -hmm. Okay, finally draws a little damage on me. Dude, I, oh yes, big down for two. Damn, dude. Three rounds quickly Nii just to answer back with took game a bite two. out of Anakin, and I think he's I gonna like, eat the rest. Anakin is not looking so hot with the jack against Paul here. He's won so many games in a row. He took a big bite. Anakin used to have a Paul Phoenix yes. of his own, and I was like, is he ever gonna bring that out? Like ever, ever? I wanted to see it. I really did. But still Anakin right now, sticking it out with Jack. I hope that's what he does for the rest of the set. You know, maybe like, he's got to find his whole way through here. Maybe next time we'll see it's Paul. I don't know. But and thanks, he might be Fathomless like Chaos. Let's see what happens. Oh, maybe uh, you think it's Fathomless or Fat Homeless. When it comes to this defense. I don't know what it is. Hey, thanks. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Gets it this time, though. For the I like fat homeless more. Hop kick ratio has gone up significantly. Still it's gonna crazy. have the tailspin. Uh, mm -hmm. Double death fist combo. But oh, Anakin's still aggressive, right? No one with two breaks though. Uh, I think we got a problem. Catching up to him right now. Now you I think we got a problem, and I think it's right named Knee. Oh, is it gonna be yeah, like that? Right? A little bit slower, maybe. I mean, he's just landing these hop kicks. Give him a chance. Okay, Give him a second to kind of. Wow, look at this situation. Corner trap man, with Jack. Corner, big oh, hit. man. Oh, bro, five rounds straight. All of a sudden, Need just flipping the switch. Man, Anakin needs to change something right now if he wants to change. If he wants to change the outcome of this next match. This match, especially. You want this mm. momentum on your side the entire time. Move. Constantly going for those jackhammers. Didn't even go for you know that uh that blue uppercut right after either. Maybe he didn't do the blue uppercut because Paul can get out of it. just to stop I'm not sure. Oh no, Perry this time around. Is that possible? Just a jab, tailspin. He's gonna be on the wall. I think Paul could get out of it with that three plus four off the ground. Look at the damage. I'm not sure. Oh my god. Oh, we just ate it. Roy just stood there. Yo, that is obliteration at its finest. Need Vaporize, dude. Dominating now, and Anakin going back to stage select. Vaporize. I, I, I saw it the first game. I was like, you know, Need didn't look like that. Paul Phoenix was ready just yet, and this is something we didn't see from Anakin Jeez. until late last time either. He didn't switch Hexen? to the stage, right? Mm -hmm. That was one of the big things. You know, Need had such a good wall nah. combo with Paul against. Uh, Sabo Ace and, and House by the stage, Cemetery. But it is not Thanks. looking pretty right now. I'll save my hexing powers for Evo. Becoming the WSOE Seven champion. Can we really hope for a reset right here? But that Paul pick coming from me just looking too strong right now. What does he used to say? Phoenix too strong. Anakin Phoenix looks 100% uh -huh. Damn. Look at the Is he really gonna the concede? I don't right believe now. it. Oh, that was looking like a delayed hop kick. <laughs> kind of scared. Thank me. you. Wow. That was crazy. He sidestepped the jackhammer and then punished it, but the recovery on the jackhammer hammer moved backwards. So the death fist whiffed because he was moving backwards. That wasn't really that harada because of, you know, it, the story adds up. Jackhammer on whiff, he goes backwards, even if it whiffs. He comes down and then moves back. So that makes it hard to punish by a lot of characters if they sidestep it. It's very common. The end of these situations still working out for me. He is finding That's part of what makes the move so good. Man. It's another right reason why it's so good. See me backing up, giving him a little space to hang himself, I suppose. Small side step right there. I wonder if Anakin noticed. 
Nice defense from Anakin there. Not getting caught. I could see forward. how the untrained eye could think oh, it's Harada's problem. The issue is that's probably why Harada gets so pissed. You know, there's so many untrained eyes out there. Anytime anyone does anything, it's like email Harada. Oh yes, charge it up. Oh shit. Oh, we didn't charge that one up. That could have been. Oh, man, need to fix Wow. Finally, that didn't even look like a whip. the momentum. Anakin on the board here in game number four. This is what he needed. If Nigga What's the wrist thing called? Uh, the like wrist I thing I use is called the M brace. I started using it because I started getting pain from playing on arcade stick on the back of my hand, and it works pretty well. It's called the M brace. M, not N. M. Like that, it is tournament point for me. W S O E. Getting tense right now, Anakin. There's nothing to funny about that. He needs to win the next two rounds. He needs to how? win the next two but rounds. How? We gotta find a consistent way. Look at the pressure. Thanks, Viper on Driver. On his back. And House by the Cemetery. Sure Don't uh, get that did you see? It? Those what? jabs are really setting the pace. Once upon a time in Hollywood. I'm gonna see it on Sunday tomorrow. Thanks, Sabo Ace. I like that down four. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna see that movie tomorrow. Tomorrow's 24 hour no stream. Stop Anakin's attempts at offense. Oh, oh big wow. time. Damn, this is big. Sure it's okay. But it's, okay. it's not believe, big Steve. enough. You gotta believe. Oh, crap. Oh, my God. He's got back to our <laughs> he's gonna hurt real bad. Yeah, I mean, if he's doing. Oh, the pixel. It's not over. Oh, it's dead. Yeah. Yeah. It's dead. It's guaranteed. That was guaranteed. The champion here at the WSOE 7 will be none other than the legend. Knee, make some noise. Oh, fuck. Yeah, make right some noise. Out. Out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Time some Thank ones, you. time some twos, time whatever you want. Knee is your W. Hey, you know what they should do is yeah, they should yeah. feed a bunch of that and fucking shaving water to rip. You see a comeback they should beer bong a fucking right? giant oh, so funnel of that shaving like water and give that shit to rip. He needed that adjustment game, you know. He had the Geese Howard before, but now You know what I mean? You know, he adjusted that ball and that was it. Well, look, we said before when we saw him, let him butt chug Paul that shit. Was the character that gave him that big W, right? Yeah, and man, that's crazy, that, dude. The, the only guy that could out, fucking possibly beat me is Arslan Ash, oh, and he lost to two How Americans. How you guys doing over there? Tell me that was unbelievable. Like, me being the champion at WSOE7 mm -hmm. with some stellar play. I mean, Fantastic. what else can what else do you want, especially heading into Evo? I mean, he's he's looking very strong. It's what we expected. He is the god, and he is what everyone's safe pick was, you know, going into the tournament. We wanted to see other guys. Corny smile. Occasion, but man, it was tough. That Cornier was than the shit I exactly took this like morning. I was really hoping. Hey, thanks, really Deceptio and KF91. Thanks very much. I feel like, like I mentioned, the first game, adjustment game, but then the Paul Phoenix, he was just running through him. I mean, all it took for, was for him to get that adjustment, right? That first game definitely looked like Anakin had something up his sleeve, just ready for the <laughs> counterfeit. But then you see the adjustments by me to be like, you know what? I know exactly what I need to <laughs> so do. Many yeah, so hey, many Hopkins. Hey, I laughed Hopkins. a lot today, at least. And realigning and just jabbing him in the face. Keeping him honest, keeping him that's on, on the bright like side. You guys know how much I love out. laughing. Without a doubt. It makes me Man, feel good. I mean, that so that's the good news. I laughed a lot. You guys were pretty funny. Why does Steve have the entire ocean on his arm? Hey, all right. Thanks. Uh, compensation bracelets. You ever consider that maybe that is a religious thing? And you are being a total intolerant bigot? You ever consider that? It's not. It's just because, you know... I don't know. I heard all of those beads have been not only in his ass, but other people's asses too. A huge congratulations to the legend, the GOAT himself, the best player in Tekken history. It is me. You think they're going to add that $7,500 check to the, the wallpaper that has $50,000 checks so all over it? That matter the most, and he is one of the best Probably players not. not. In Tekken history, but in fighting game and esports history, he goes with seventy five hundred dollars hundred believable I, I have to say my crown my hat goes off to you congratulations again that's gonna be it for us for now don't worry we'll be right back in a bit but i'm gonna throw it over to slacks and mark back on the desk well well Ooh. well that what an event what a tournament this kind of shapes things up in a major way i mean me 
dominating the field. This shakes yeah. things up I can't wait to see more by keeping them exactly the same the fucking way inside. they've been. Nobody can no beat me, and now things are really shaking up. <laughs> They're really shaking up now. Now, things are shaking up. Nobody can beat me. Everything's exactly as it was. Unstirred. Undisturbed. But, Ladies and gentlemen, shook up. we do have some bounties coming out. So oh, we, we do we have the results? We do have the results. Let's go and check them out. Most viewed clip, Jimmy J and Arslan. Oh, wow, already. Yeah. Damn, Jimmy J and Arslan. Look at that. And of course, most sweeps and most reverse sweeps. We had JDCR and Anakin, of course, that in that faction. And then a four-way tie. A four-way tie. That's right. And there it is. The WSOE medallion. Medallion. This looking good. He is now the Soak champion. If anybody Madik. wants to take that title from him, they got to take him back. So let's go ahead and check in with Rip and Steve and the other boys. Get in there. Yeah, that other boy is KP. And, um, <laughs> you know, it's just a thing. No socks. He doesn't have much words, but I'm in the booth with men who had a lot the... of words for this event. Talk to they're me. doing okay, some weird the... basic instinct thing right now where they're all crossing their legs at the same time. <laughs> all I'm saying is that we know what Tekken does, right? Yeah. We've seen these guys. We've been waiting for them to play Evo is next week. Mm -hmm. Sharon this Stone. Is the first sample of seeing it. Everybody's looking pretty sharp to so me. A little, little taste. Taste. Sure. Just a little, 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 little bit. Just a little bit. You know? He's looking sharp. You know, JDCR's Arm King is looking better, in my opinion. Jimmy J. Tran is playing well. Arsenal Nash, of course, you know, had a rough trip over here, but I think he's still going to show up at Evo and perform. I agree. Listen, uh, Slain Speed Kicks, he was here as an alternate. Don't sleep on my mans. And um, do you think, with Tekken being so hard <laughs> to pick one outside of Thank anything, you. a safe pick? Evo, give me a prediction while we're here. Me. I mean, it'd be hard pressed to say anybody except for Nee right now. I'm not. I can't. You can't sugarcoat that, man. Nee, nee is the man that be, we've seen Loha go down. We've seen JDCR go down, uh -huh. but we have not seen Nee take a L. The thing, right, well, the thing about it though is that Arslan Ash is the guy who beats Nee, and he didn't have a chance hey, to here. But he's you guys, the tournament. If he meets him, you guys Evo, think that they uh, decided to Lohar not Lohar use the Nina cosplayer for this? As we say, thank you because I said something. I hope I didn't hurt anyone's feelings. Hey, if it makes you feel any better, Nina cosplayer, this shit fucking sucks too. In fact, I think you were much better. WSOE7. It's been absolutely incredible. This is my six of seven WSOEs that I've been a part of. And I'm telling you, they keep getting better and better. So don't worry. WSOE8 is going to be coming up. We haven't announced it yet, but. We will be, okay? So stick around. Thank you so much for hanging out with us today. Lauren Jabara signing off. Fallout, sending it over to you to finish this thing off. Damn, we got Jabara. Thanks so much, Lauren. Of course, the WSOE legend continues with another medallion awarded. This time to me, the best player in Tekken history. But what a day it was. Bandai Namco, Soul Calibur 6, Tekken 7. We had unbelievable action. Yeah, all right. Unbelievable action. Today, and I'll tell you. You know, it started out pretty damn good. I think the Arslan match was so fucking sick. I, you know, it's too bad. Honestly, it's too bad he didn't. He wasn't able to play his first match for multiple reasons. First of all, uh, we got to make up all that shit about how Jimmy J six owed him, but it's also too bad because we didn't get to see him play that much. All he did was play Jimmy J right here. All he did was play Jimmy J, and he was just outclassed. <laughs> Ah, you guys talk a little too much shit. And honestly, you know, I'm getting tired of it. Anyway, mm, chat room. Hey, thanks. Uh, God loather, thanks for the subscription. Uh, and listen, the rest of you guys, I got to tell you, if I didn't watch this with you, I would have been complaining the whole time about how weird and obnoxious it was. So first of all, thanks for these stoners for letting me restream it. That's first of all. Uh, you know, so that's cool. I appreciate that. Go over and look at their stream. Uh, and also, thanks to you stoners for joining me. Because if they just let me restream it, it still probably wouldn't have been cool. I need them to let me restream it, and I need you guys to also join me. It's like those things are all required together. I can't have just one. So, thanks for making that equation, you know work itself out nice shit i'm gonna wrap this shit up chat room i'm gonna go drink me some shaving water and then sound like mickey mouse
Thanks again for watching and liking my stream.